not Negan. Uh, well, it was P, P Jack, first of all. Or Jack Seven, whatever. Like, he's fighting the Boston Dynamics robot. <laughs> Boston Dynamics robot? That's actually terrifying. Have you seen some of the new uh, ways they, they've got, like, actuators and, and, and just well, engineering? Dude, I just posted a picture earlier, uh, posted a video earlier of them uh, dancing to uh, Do You Love Me? Like, yeah. they had a choreographed, like, three-man dance troupe. We're we're watching Skynet slowly being built before our eyes. Yeah, but it's just gonna be it's just gonna be like us, and it'll only like cat videos and stuff, and it'll just be mad when we don't make more cat videos. Oh God! So it's not gonna like dominate us, but it's gonna like throw and mimic everything. It'll be like a Robo Illuminati. Mm-hmm. But it'll be like we love humans. <laughs> They're the most entertaining thing on the you. planet. <laughs> we seek to save you from yourselves. Yeah. All right. Oops, that's not correct. Oh, so he's rolling out the 10 string? Oh, oh my I did god. The wrong one. Right to start out the gate and he's ten throwing the mozzarella. Oh my god. Uh -huh. Oh my god. Okay, 15 seconds and he's finally blocked it. Good god. Ooh, yeah. down two, three. He's got the red dress on. <laughs> he's gonna break it. Damn, that was a lot of damage. Sticking in crouch. Oh, he missed the slide. I saw him hit it. Oh, that's a tough one to punish. I actually don't know if that's negative 15. I think that's negative 14. Oh, no, we could have launched that. Jabs and oh. no. I like the stove top, uh, stove top hat on Chef. Right. Like a dangerous Dave. Abraham Lincoln. <laughs> <laughs> if Abraham Lincoln learned Cobra Kai or something. Uh, yeah, historical fact. Uh, Abraham Lincoln founded Cobra Kai. <laughs> Patron, patron founding saint. I cannot tell a lie. <laughs> I'm about to ruin that ass. <laughs> Four score and 78 bearings ago. Oh, okay, down to three. Up. Bop, bop. To the wall. Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh, oh that was free hit damage. city. Yeah, he he needed to not drop that combo because you know when you're the mayor, you got responsibilities like mm -hmm. that. Okay, blocks that. He could have got a bigger punish. I'm the man. Down to three. Okay, going for the tailspin. What's the damage here? Okay, proper DSS. Ooh, the blue shit said no. They're about even here. Oh. Round mm. four. Donnie just letting it go there. Was not a good place to be. Oh, and there he goes throwing out the ten hit strings again. Things are about are to turn serious? darko for Donnie. Uh, uh oh, blocked it, but uh, wrong pick up there. Uh, gets uppercut though. He's gonna break the wall. Oh. Nope. Yo, that was actually pretty. Whoa! Whoa! A cross chop combo. We My don't man have did those. The, did the Mike Guy dynamic entry? <laughs> that was crazy. Okay, slidey. Wow! Ooh. Burns the blue stuff and gets jabbed to death. Donnie go answering back. Yep. Tie game. Tie game. Ooh, the start down two three. This is going to be all yep, to the wall. Oh, barely lifts. Okay, just the, still just the one splat, yeah. That was a 50% okay. combo. Oh. oh, this is leaning heavily in Donnie's favor. But yeah, we've seen Ace have to just throw the whole sink out. Ooh. Barely a slice. Oh, Wins that's on all the it's trade. Up. Donnie. Game one. That was a huge shift from how that how that match started. Because it looked like Ace was going to take it. Super fast for sure. And instead, and now we Donnie all need to get out no. of the way so they can do it again. Yeah, get out of the way, sir. I'm, I'm, you know why? Did, yeah. I got I got a set to win. <laughs> got them melons to cash in. Yeah. Let me go. It's the much more respectful version. Uh, excuse me, madam. Could you possibly uh, step aside? <laughs> Please step out the side. Step to the side. Excuse Avert me, madam. Your Could you step to the side? <laughs> <laughs> Are teeing up again. I wonder if we're gonna see. Yeah, that, that was the other character that A Chef plays as is Lucky Chloe. That's how I remember him. Mm. Okay. Do we see Lucky Chloe come out in this situation, or do you continue sticking with, you know, the Fock himself? Is it gonna be time to stop fucking around? Or are you gonna mm. Chloe it up? What's it gonna be? Maybe enjoy a nice uh, a nice bowl of Faku ramen. <laughs> Faku ramen. In Chloe's, it's good cereal. Mm. They're always trying to get their hands on me, Lucky Chloe. Shushai, 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 shushai.
You're like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I've heard that one before, bro. Yeah, she's like, you're not a funny. <laughs> <laughs> I have a joke for you. Knock, knock. Who's that? You're not the funny. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> I'm just going to go mute myself now. <laughs> I think I can handle this, bro. <laughs> All right. Match two. Hey, bro, I did the with it. student. I did the lucky. I did the lucky charms joke. We did bad Irish accents and everything. Yeah, you, where were you? Yeah. You Jesus know what? Christ. Cancel the stream. It, it's done. You know what? Fuck this. It's over. You were supposed All to right. pick Howard Estate. Round one. Uh, oh, okay. <laughs> well, it's Infinite Azure, so here we yeah, are. So you got to end the stage. <laughs> so here you go. Tried to do the ten hit string again. Doesn't work. Whoa. Big moves coming out. Mm. Sliding. Nope. Go oh, catches ride. him with the classic. Didn't take oh. 15 seconds. I've seen at least two down, two threes. Yikes. I love it. Dragon Cannon. Chef keeps rolling right up into his range. Just telling him, nah, you can get in my grill, but you're going to get kicked back to this Salt Earth. That's Ooh, a low good, parry. Yeah, the low parry was a good start. Oh, blocks that hell sweep. That's a big punish. You it. Okay, DSS, really? let's go. Okay, sliding Slidey. in. Oh, I tried it again. <laughs> Donnie seemingly feeling himself right now. Yeah, Donnie says, hey, has got an answer, but not getting hit by the two hits. <laughs> Roll with what works. We got the rage. Oh, oh. Almost had the three piece. Didn't count. It don't matter. The can, three can, can. Four. Puts him down, down, down. Two can, can, Sam. What? Oh, sidestep. Follow your nose. Oh, missed it, but. These really, vicious really blows. Really some chances. Going oh. for the 10 hit again. Ooh, oh, ooh. we got a proper oh, punish. Oh, I like oh. this. Oh. Well done. Putting Donnie in the red dress. That's going to be a tough spot. Yeah, wow, there's a lot oh, of damage. Oh, there were so many recovery Whoa. frames on that. Dang. A shift got lucky. You could see it. The duck was there. He was going to get hit in the chin, sir. A chef for him. Gets interrupted. <laughs> oh, nah. my gosh. Not riding the C bus today. Wow, I thought that was the hell sweep. It wasn't, okay? Nope. Doesn't punish if it slides to victory. Donnie's got the, the short range uh, slide maneuver down pat. He's got a pretty good canceling. Tries to run in and the knee gets stopped. Okay, nice oh, small damage. Oh, big throw. Doesn't break the one grab. Nope. Keeps him just oh, out of oh, rage. Oh, oh, revenge throws. Uh-oh, we got those. Just barely out of oh, rage for both of them. No, and catches the ankles. Oh my gosh, a chef scraping it by. Ooh. Says, check the ankles. I'm going to do it. Get this banana peel, though. Uh, okay. Uh, Balls uh, for it uh. again. Oh, my goodness. Already down like 80%. Chunky damage. A chef just out of uh, just out Oh, of rage. nice grab. Grabbed him out of that. Said, Ooh. sit down, sir. I'm not losing. Oh, Hell, that ground bounce, though. Wow. Managed to get something there, but doesn't capitalize nice on it. Ooh, the trade. Uh -oh. But... Oh! There's the 10 hit string again. Oh, it burns the blue stuff. Donnie finds his way in. Oh, that my was so gosh. Close, but he gets the 2 0. He snatched that away. A chef was determined to bring that back, and Donnie said, No. Yep. No victory for you. No victory for you. So a straight two. Mm hmm. The All right. So up next is going to be uh, Britney Spears, and it's magic time. So, uh. Britney? Yeah. Years. Right, I'm, I'm gonna start kicking folks. Get out. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta Get kick you, my, my guy. Plane. <laughs> <laughs> Give me back my family. <laughs> Give me back my boy. <laughs> All right. Uh, let's see. Family. We're looking for It's Rebellion and. What was the other one? Britney Spears? Uh, Britney Spears. That guy. I'm pretty sure I sent the, the friend invite. How could you? Let's try again. Jesus, Matchstick. I thought we went over this like 40 times. Dude, like, I can only send the friend request so many times. Hey, don't you get snippy with me. I <laughs> It'll be a day of reckoning for you. I can't spell, but I don't care. 
spelling. Not that important. Not that important. The computer will do it for me. The Boston Dynamics robots will do all my spelling for me. This signified the moment in history that spelled our impending dune to the mechanized takeover. Yeah. All right, everyone can watch me as I go B R I D D Y S. Look, right there, right there. It's right there. All right. I will send the match invite, but I have sent the friend request already. I'm pretty sure Is that's it on the VOD. All right. And Lamont, you you need to be in here already. <laughs> You're gonna make me go look at my frame list. <laughs> he got it. <laughs> All right, good, good. Everyone's on wire. Well done, well done. Yay! All right, it is. Except for me. Good job, buddy. Yep, because I don't need to be <laughs> yet. I ain't learning this game. You know what? I was thinking about that, but I was like, damn, you know, outside of like one, I don't, you know, like one or two things. I really don't know what kind of games he plays. Uh, I'm lucky to find time to actually play legit video games, because quite honestly, I, I spend a lot of time playing uh, mobile games on Android emulators. Hey, whatever, whatever floats your passion and, and, on that. There's some there's pretty good a, mobile games. There's a big grind on on this particular one. Oh yeah, which one is that? Uh, it's uh, Final Fantasy Brave Exvius. Oh, I'm familiar with that one. Yeah. Oh man. I'm actually kind of a high rank player, and that means that I gotta keep grinding to stay that way. <laughs> yep. Yep. I've been there with several games like that. I I have I have skinny dipped in this end of the pool. Mm. That's kind of why and I'm afraid why to pick I, up something like Genshin Impact because then I'd be I, like, you know well, what? that's what I was just about to say. Yeah, I was like, well, I can't now, touch it. I now I have to. no life. <laughs> it's just gonna be work, I, home, I know Genshin, what it Final Fantasy. No more streaming. Sorry, everyone. <laughs> It's like I'm. I'm also getting. Uh, I'm. I'm kind of making a slow pull back to Final Fantasy XIV. So, mm. oh, that's another one that that's I'm like, oh my god, one. what am I doing? Yo, we got a Brian Fury in here. Oh boy. Okay. Oh, these are backwards. So, Bree, sticking it. Sticking it with. Uh, okay, Marduk, so Magic Time is Brian Fury. We got. Yeah, we got Marduk from Britney Spears. And they're playing pretty conservatively so far. Lots it's of good sidestepping. Oh. Yeah, exchange of pokes. I like this. Okay. Oh, doesn't block the snake edge? Mm. Wow. I heard legends about that snake edge. Snake edge, man. First one, it'll set you straight. They're both in the red right now. 30 seconds. He gets oh. speared. Pretty spears doing some spearing. So I'm guessing there's a lot of armor on that move. <laughs> uh, no armor. It just no? Did, the orbital didn't hit. Yeah, the orbital's a uh, hitbox. Kind of... The active frames on at the end aren't as great as you think. Huh. Once it whiffs, it whiffs. Ooh. Okay, manages to parry block into a mount. Doesn't break the wand. Goes for the stomp. Ow. Oh wow! I didn't know he had. Uh, didn't know he had Alex moves in this game. <laughs> oh god, yes. That's that's actually a pretty good move. Finishing off rounds. Snake edge number two do, to the do, wall. Do 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 do. do. Okay, goes, doesn't duck the second hit. Neither duck in the second mm -hmm. hit. Plus frame. Low parry. Oh, yeah. To put Britty in a very good position here. Got him cornered. Low parry. Oh, oh went for the full string. Didn't finish it. Oh, uh, are we going through the, oh, going through the, the doors? Wall. Going through the doors? Doesn't break the chains. No, not yet. Uh, oh, switch position. This is scary. Oh, gosh. Blue stuff versus Rage Art. Just enough armor. Yep. Oh, boy. We're going to watch this cutscene now. <laughs> Wow. The angriest beating ever. <laughs> he took him straight to the corner, too. Says, you're not getting away. 
All right, Britney Spears taking game one. Pretty solid uh, game one there for Britney. Yeah, you know, I mean, it was definitely right close, reads. but he, he ended up clutching every single round. Seeing, seeing a little bit of familiarity from, uh, apologies from uh, Magic Time, but uh, you know, just just a little little more adjustments to to try to get that in, just kind of getting outpoked in you know small little exchanges that are happening. Mm -hmm. Was Magic gonna stick with Brian? What's the call? Or is there magic still to be found with the Brian pit? <laughs> well, is there a first it was magic, now it's know. rebellion. Now it's rebellion? Oh mm -hmm. no. Mm -hmm. Transformed. I like how Britty Britty and, and, and uh Magic Time basically have the same icon, it's just different perspective on it. <laughs> like when you really think Like one's about isometric, you know, yeah, one's like one's, front. No. Exactly. Straightforward, <laughs> the other one's just a nice three quarters turn. <laughs> Not even enough for a prison shot, but definitely enough mm -hmm. to make you scared. Yeah, yeah. They they don't they don't make you hit that angle on the on the police lineup. No, but that is the angle you see before you die. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So is he sticking with it? Yep. Brian Martin sticking with his guns. We got two muscle bound heads here. Power of the the juggernauts. Hmm. Of course, Magic Time likes Brian Fury. <laughs> pepperoni versus pepperoni. Who do you got? <laughs> nah, this is pepperoni versus sausage. <laughs> versus ham. Versus ham? Yeah, this is this is bacon versus this ham. <laughs> okay, we're out in the cold, but you know. But I've the soul no still burns. On. Oh, wrong game. Right. <laughs> oh boy. Oh man, it's just to get him with the transition. Oh boy, this is chunky damage. Chonk chonk. Boop. Boop, boop, Ten boop, seconds boop, in, boop, and Birdie has almost got this. That all is right, so much. Well, seven golden letters yeah. in thirteen seconds. Good God! First one of yeah, those today. See it. Oh, tried to snake edge and jabbed him out of it. Oh, hey, good sidestep by Birdie. Gonna get a lot of oh, out, out of this. Excellent sidestep. I actually thought that was gonna hit. Mm. Okay, keeping him mixed up, making him guess between a low and a mid. I oh, like gets the grab on wake up too. Birdie keeping up their tremendous pressure like a freight train. A double side step to the deep, deep uppercut. And we saw what we saw there was just three situations of forcing the guess. Is it mm -hmm. going to be a low? Is it going to be a mid? And it was a mid every time. Oh, good pick up there from Britty. Rebellion oh, getting look, pushed look at onto the last leg. Look at him dancing. The scary stuff. It's mm -hmm. like it's just a breakdown. Oh, I got to make something happen, and it doesn't. Leva bro, Britney Spears, really hammering it home that time. Two zero oh victory. My God, yeah. Good lord. Solidly taking it there. Yep. Oh, geez, text messages at the wazoo. All right. Anyway, um, but yeah, uh, good stuff there. Thanks, gentlemen. Uh, please leave. <laughs> Yes, get out. <laughs> hey, all right. Got that. All right. So, yep. Um, so, A Chef and Magic Time are now sitting in separate parts of the loser's bracket. Um, gentlemen, as, if you are within the sound of my voice, as soon as you hear, as soon as you get an opponent uh, in the loser's side, go ahead and play them off stream. We will catch up with the loser's bracket, hopefully around semifinals. Uh, we're going to try to get as many of the winner's games on stream as we possibly can. Uh, to that effect, we now have Competitive Casual versus our boy Donnie Go. This should be an interesting one. Uh, mm. Really getting a lot of great effect from his usage of law in that previous set, you know, but that was against an opponent that, in a chef, really likes to throw buttons, right? Mm -hmm. You know, and it can work with some big damage, and competitive casual is going to be a vastly different animal in that regard. Very different player. Absolutely. So it's going to come down to, to really challenging competitive and, and trying to challenge the massive amount of knowledge and, and intuition that competitive casual has. And that is a tough, tough and tall order. 
Hey, there's the renegade. But we all gotta learn it sometime, right? Exactly. Don't learn today. <laughs> Think I'll learn today. You go to jail now, too? <laughs> Everyone's getting <laughs> twisted tea upside the face. Twisted tea. I cannot believe that there is a meme about that going on right now. So many memes. I've seen Cloud Sword as the Twisted Tea can. I've seen, what was it? Um, they did the, uh, um, that scene from South Park where, uh, uh, Randy's trying to guess, uh, the, the N-word that's missing a vowel <laughs> and oh, the cameraman's no. holding a can of Twisted Tea waiting for it. <laughs> yeah, that one, they did one of the uh, the American martial artist in um, Napoleon Dynamite. They did one with his oh, American pants one. on. Yeah, it's like all Twisted Tea over it and it's like, you know, like who wants to get kicked, roundhouse kicked to the face when I'm wearing these bad boys? <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, we got Donnie in competitive casual, supposedly ready to go. They're locking in. Get with it, Tekken servers. Sloosh got a, a, a library of waifus and, 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 a, and a few of the, the husbandos that he yeah, played. Yeah, it's mostly, it's mostly waifus, though. <laughs> Raven-haired waifus, and if they mm -hmm. don't have it, there's a custom for Raven, it. Raven-haired waifus and Eddie. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> And now Fang, because he's playing he's playing Fang again. Oh, is he? Okay. <laughs> See, that could be good here. You say you're playing you're playing uh Fung and uh Fang and Street Fighter, and everyone's like, why? Do you hate yourself? <laughs> Excuse me? Okay, you going lose, Lily. Lose a bet. <laughs> And we're going to the per, like the actual like insurmountable number two stage mm -hmm. that everyone likes, with the Pac-Man Arena being the Soul Tekken God Omega of stages right now. <laughs> People actually petitioning Namco, don't uh, don't take that away from us. Make it a permanent fixture. You can't take that away from me. They're just doing a little pokes here. Kind of feeling each other out. Sloosh very oh. aware of that. It, Still jockeying in the middle here. Oh. Okay, goes for the twister. Yeah. What is that? Like uh, forward, forward, uh, three, four? Or three uh, plus four? Something like that. I actually don't know the notation. I've just always called it the twister. Mm. Hashtag KFC. <laughs> Whoa. Hashtag the KFC console. Kick. Play your games yeah, and keep your, keep your chicken warm. <laughs> Have your own gaming machine. Okay, gets the low poke out of there. Chicken wing. Might as well use that overheating PlayStation processor to, to keep your chicken hot. Right? A little i7 action there. Mm -hmm. Oh, it only runs at a cool 90C. <laughs> which is really fucking hot. But anyway. It's pretty good. Competitive casual on the verge of uh, seven golden letters, putting a lot of pressure oh. on. Okay, snatches it with a magic yeah. four. Donnie gets the moral victory. Competitive's got to be wondering why he didn't punish that oh. while standing, too. That was a good sidestep. I'm surprised he couldn't get the punish. Kind of backing off. A little, little unsure oh. here, but gets it with a while standing four. With the high, high kicks. Uh, Super Kami JoJo in the chat asks where we are. We are in the Midwest, sir. Uh, straight out of Columbus, Ohio. Stomp there. Doesn't fall for the mid. Okay. Hop kick. Doesn't get a combo, though. That's nope. A little uncharacteristic there. Ooh, oh, sidestep. there it is. Hurt. Casual oh, dancing away. Ooh. Yes. Asking Donnie the rebellion. <laughs> hey, look at the boots. You see these boots? Look at the legs. Look at the leg. Look they at the were leg. made for look walking, but also kicking. They're made for walking, <laughs> yeah, but also kicking. <laughs> Slidey. Oh, oh, nice duck on the knee there. Tried to float for something and yeah, didn't get it. Yeah, yeah. Okay, almost 15 seconds. Mm. Donnie's still in the red. Oh, he yeah. had him at the back. Ah, just out of range of that slide. And of course, mm. Casual does the good punish. Game one going to competitive Casual. Manages to just sneak out that low, and it just didn't catch. Yeah. Probably has a child under his arm to... while he's doing it, too. 
giving all the kids the best cuddles yep. while he gives start the best Starting while he whoops everyone's ass. Yeah. <laughs> Hang on a sec, hon. Hang on. I, I, I got this. I got this. <laughs> I got this. I got this. That's what's up. All right. And hey, they are back into it. Skip button for the win. Lining it back up. Did we see Is Rebellion North Dakota close it? enough to join attorney sometime? That is a good question. We can always try. Oh, yeah. Um, I tend to figure that like a good 600 mile radius is probably the edge of things. But again, we've had folks um, for our Thursday night GBVS tournaments uh, play from like Texas and uh, Georgia. Uh, so, you know, deeper parts of the south. So it can work. But yeah, we would have to we would have to try. Give it the old testerino. Mm-hmm. Oh, I'm so sick of testing things right now. <laughs> I'm so sorry, it's bro. My, it's my whole computer job now. It's just like like, oh you gotta test the fans and the LEDs and the motherboard and the power supply. Okay. Just gotta make sure that thing posts. All right. <laughs> Yeah, you, so you probably hear tests like randomly as hallucination. Hey, you get that test and that test. Hey, yeah. you know that test, 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 test. Test. Yeah, I'm, don't you I'm, love it? I'm getting testy from all these tests. Oh my god. Match tick, match test, match yeah. test melee. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> Say that fast. That's gonna be really hard. Match, match test, test melee. Match test melee. Match test melee. All right, show off. <laughs> Red leather, yellow leather, red leather, yellow leather. Oh my god. He sells seashells by the seashore. Su Su Studio. Su Su Studio. <laughs> god, going back to the Vermilion game. Yeah, man. We okay, love it. Just check it bit. Excellent number two stage. Got the back yep. again. Not even on lie if the counter hit, though. Yeah. Drops it. You can ring out on this stage if this were Soul Calibur. Could you imagine ring outs in a Tekken game? Oh, oh the community would be bro. so pissed. Oh! Bro, that's, that's the floor break. That was an amazing transition. Sure. With the twister, though, saying this is not low fat. Let's go. <laughs> Round two. Yo, you're about to, about to drink some whole milk, son. Oh, boy, it's the ooh, down three. Ooh, 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 ooh. This is the last hit there. This is his chance. Oh, wow. It's the slidey. Oh, that could have been big. Yeah, casual try to do the, I believe it's a, uh, like a duck, sh like a duck style shove thing there. That definitely would have put uh, Donnie on his back, but. Oh. Good check there. Good punish on the wall standing too. You like it. Mm -hmm. Okay, doesn't break the one plus two and takes round two. Brian, the neck grab. You're going to need a chiropractor from that <laughs> the one. The neck grab. Ooh, was that season four? I've never seen that move before. Check some of the few pokes. Breaks the launcher. That's a big one. <laughs> okay, tried to go for the mix-up with the stomp and ducks under it. Wow, madness. They switch sides. 20 seconds in. Rebellion. Got to make something happen. Misses with the snake edge. Straight up sidestepped it. Yep. Oh, didn't expect that. Figured a regular punish was coming and got hop kicked instead. Ooh, the dragon cannon. That's big. Oh, checks while standing. Stunting. I'm not Ooh. out of this yet. Yeah. Do you believe in the oh. dragon? Blue snuff gets blocked. Unfortunately, not safe enough. Either that or Donnie was uh, trying to press the advantage by hitting a button. That but, was a really good block on, yeah. on competitive casuals part. Because it's getting hit by that at the wall. That, that gives a whole entire situation that's just not in your favor. And it would have absolutely have given... Our boy Rebellion, a chance to bring it back. Get around on the board, that mental Shove. victory. <laughs> Sloosh tosses in one of those GGs. All right. Well, time for Artsy Nate and Ola. Artsy Nate and Ola. Yeah. And it might be time to kick Donnie out of here. Bye. There you go. Bye. <laughs> See ya. Don't let the door hit you in the asshole, bitch. Meow. <laughs> All right. I've seen me. A little too authentic. Holy crap. <laughs> I'm sorry, folks. <laughs>
It's cool. I'm friend. I'm, I'm friends with uh, SK Sin. <laughs> That's the part that makes a difference. <laughs> <laughs> this changes everything. <laughs> All right, we got the Ola. Ola showing his ranks here. Look yeah, at that, man. Leroy? He's putting in that work. Bruh, are we about to see that Leroy? I, you know what? Ola's been keeping up. Oh, I know he's putting in work. And I also know he's doing work outside of that, too. <laughs> smart, smart man. What's he working on? Tell me since he can't tell me. Since he doesn't tell you, no, uh, since well, he I can't tell me. Ooh, well, I guess I'll let him elaborate on it. That's what? his story. No. Swag God back. How come I'm not following you? I do I know you? <laughs> I've heard that name, TK Shawnee. King of dropped combos. He said he's a Mishima Jesus. player in Ohio. Man, tell him to tell him to to flip and join our tournaments, man. Yeah, yeah. There's plenty of, of online stuff that's going yeah, on. We Ohio can side. definitely expand our Tekken uh, Tekken influence. Like the the spin I put on that, the influence. Ah, <laughs> oh, we're going Steve. Bluesh vetting him in less than thirty eight words. <laughs> yeah, Lashawn is good peeps. All right, that's all I need to hear. That's all we need to do. He's yeah, that's a free pass. <laughs> but yeah. Those are dragons nests. Ola using Yoshimitsu. I'm shook. No, Surprising that's what he did last time. He even I had did the, not the, remember that. Yeah, he even did had I? Orange Ghost. He even had Pac Man wow. Ghost. I'm sure Lamont oh is uh, is yelling in jealousy right now. Right? But that's a that's a. Biffy custom. Good yeah, God, is. I love it. Gets the counter hit. Hey, Ola. Showing his combo chops. Yep, yep. Must be unblockable. We'll take him to the wall. This is a bad oh, spot. Oh, wow. They got switch the, sides, though. He got prone in everything, and there was no punish. Oh, Door. burns the burns the armor there and doesn't yeah. do anything about it. Double drop kick. right now. It's always my favorite move. Well. Izuna drops and, and two twin-legged drop kicks. That yeah. just makes my whole day. That's Armor King in the shell, man. Mm -hmm. Anytime I can play Armor King, I'm using drop kicks. Uh, it's like Noctis, Siegfried. Noctis as a drop kick. Yeah. Oh, Siegfried, definitely. Yeah. In full armor? Like, come on. <laughs> that should do Half-Life. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It should be an unblockable. <laughs> just to be an it, asshole, because that game is full of like, banana shit. As if you, like, pole vaulted off of his, off of his sword to do it. <laughs> Dude. <laughs> Got a built-in key charge and parry. It's like freaking spiral <laughs> arrow. Bonkers. Yeah, spiral arrow with it. Okay, stomps the feet. Ooh, nice oh, get up. Oh, he lost out on that forward forward too. It just didn't come out right. Typ typ typically, if you stay down, that move will not hit you when you're staying down. But if mm. you try to roll, it'll hit you. Okay, doesn't break the rainbow road. Goes for the low. Okay, checks him with mid. He almost punished it, but delayed it. Alright, C8. Probably a little off trying to shake off some nerves. Those last two rounds were uh, not in his favor. I'd be shaking as well. Gotta take a moment to step back. 30 seconds in, he's in red. Kind of backing up. They're still in the middle of the stage. Thought he could get something off the jab coming in. Getting the healing there. This is not good. Checks in there. Mm. Artsy Nade really not sure how to how to play that that particular situation. It's, well, it's, a, gonna... it's a good year for Yoshi's man. Like they're real strong in in caliber. They're real strong in Tekken. It is a character that that thrives on being unpredictable and creative, and right? Not taking a straightforward. <laughs> yeah, you can you can mix that in there, and yeah, you're in <laughs> kind of a not so great sauce, but nonetheless, it's still sauce, right? Nobody said it was going to be gluten-free or vegan. <laughs> so no Ola is locked in for Yoshimitsu. Mm -hmm. Got to win this. He's up one in this first two. Artsy Nate. 
really wasn't sure of uh, how to approach this Yoshimi Yoshimitsu matchup. You know, it's, it's a lot of unconventional play, right? It's not right. just something that just... You, you have to really be aware of what the Yoshimitsu player wants to do. And that's the job of the Yoshimitsu player, to make it unpredictable. We all know the, the one of the best Yoshimitsu's ever and uh, I musician and all the clips that pop up of these crazy things he does. Get Renegade on this commentary? We might swap him in actually because uh, when Mr. J goes away I'm, I might need a co-commentator. I mean to play your match I don't expect that you're like you know leaving leaving. <laughs> Oh yeah, no, and I mean just considering I can't commentate and play at the same time. That's I mean a I'm skill sure you I do can. not possess. You seem like a talented guy. <laughs> Slightly talented. Put a pad in his hand, and man, I can I can make some magic work. Mm -hmm. Everyone's all like, "It's magic time!" Like good oh. though. The silver Buddha. <laughs> silver it's Buddha. Cyber, it's yeah, Buddha cyber from silver Cyberpunk. Buddha. <laughs> It's like the it's like the background statue in Sagat stage got up and decided to pick a fight. <laughs> right. They they got into a dystopian society, Rainbow Road. Mm. Edged him with it again. Oh, that doesn't work as a natural hit combo. Just to close the gap there. Knows to punish is the hop kick. Ola sitting pretty, but not if he's getting wall splat and Ooh. slippery kicks. I Ola's still got the pretty healthy life lead there, so I'm not worried That's about a him solid just yet. Look. RC Nate, got to make something happen here. He's got 25 seconds. Go so oh. low. Counter hit. Okay, Takes gets the off. ground yeah, hit. Yeah. Nice thing about Ed is he can actually uh, take advantage of all the times that uh, Yoshi puts himself onto the ground. Oh, look at this. Ola just happy uh, sitting back. He's got the life lead. He's helicoptering. Mm. Five seconds. Time's he got to get in there. In my tech oh, my oh, gosh. No. Wait, did he bring it? Oh. Take it. Oh, I gave it to both. What? Damn, that was exactly even? They were exact? Are you kidding that me? That never happens. Kiwis and cucumbers, what the fuck? <laughs> oh, misses with the low. Going for relaxed. Okay, kip ups. Oh, that's a big nice. punish yep. for that. Oh, using the pogo Five standing underneath. right outside the death range. Ooh. Got him in the red stuff. They are just trading blows. Yep. Doesn't punish that. That's launch punishable. Oh, the get up kick saves him. Oh, he went for a oh, suicide, suicide and killed himself. Oh, no. I think he's like, I think he's one for three on those that I've seen him do. Oh, man, that suicide gave that round away. Sure did. Ola's got to be thinking about that. Keeping cool. Didn't Ooh. want to press the issue. Got to get through the shock. Helicopter. Bikes him back down though. He said, "No, not today." It's like a really well, slow to spinning bird kick. <laughs> <laughs> spinning bird, spin on uh, bird, kick. <laughs> they articulate every syllable. Yeah, okay, exactly. At the wall. It's not a super move. Solo's round to win. He Ooh. gets the combo. Can you finish this? Boop, boop. Well, one ties it up. This is so uh, the set point for Ola. Didn't need this. Didn't need this uh, suicide. Yes, answering back. Ola does not want to let the ground get away from him. Does generic throw, though. Okay, rolls to victory. Mm -hmm. Oh, break. Good this time. break. Yeah. That hop kick is stuff. such a good tool for Nate. Nate's yes. got to get on the board here. Oh. Slippery kicks. Yeah. We see it in the final round. Is this the momentum switch we need? You've got to feel the flow. Artsy Nate is in a good spot here. Goes for the low mm. and ties it up. Ooh, Artsy Nate's got to be sighing. But now we're Deeply locked in on. Himself. Yeah, I was almost said DJ. Now we're locked in. DJ, on... side in DJ. DJ, <laughs> don't play no more slow jams. What? Stomp on to replay. Turn the music up. Artsy Nate coming back, yeah. fighting just uh, by the skin of his teeth to survive. Let's he see manages if, uh, to get one on the board. Yeah, you think Ola is if... going to stay with Yosh? Is the Yosh still in? I don't know. I mean, it seems like who he's been running lately, but... I mean, the the picture is, is uh, clearly not Yoshi anymore. Correct. You gotta say, though, I mean, when you really look at the comparison, you know, the, 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 the botched suicide there, 
really kind of cost him that game, right? If if that had connected, oh, you yeah, know, yeah, you could at the very least he would have had another one. round to work with. Yeah. But hey, like I said, with Yoshimitsu players, you have to play unpredictable. Mm -hmm. Like you would think, oh, I'll only use that to finish off the match, you know, off a set, you know. Yeah, right. why not go for it in the middle of round two? If it's your first night, you shot. have to Hatakiri. At least once. You got to get the L going through your Harakiriing phalanges. Mm -hmm. All right, game three. Hmm, 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 hmm. Wow, that's some serious art. <laughs> One that goes for all the bottle caps, and he's sticking with Eddie. Yeah, I like it. Well, well of yeah. course he is. He's locked in, but yeah, Ola, he's locked in. Locking in the Yoshimitsu. Ola, Ola had the option to go to his other characters. Like Tried Nina. to commit to it. Yeah, and let's see if that commitment pays off. Right Ooh. now, it's looking punishing because we're in Kinder Gym. This is the, the, the inner last... chamber of my mind. This is how insanity works. All right. It's a low kick. Okay, doesn't check him on the mid. Misses. Yeah. Yoshimitsu is representative of my desires, while the room itself is a representation of my mental state. <laughs> God, it's like the cell. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> this is a murderer's haven. Okay, doesn't launch that. Ooh. Breaks the throw. Yeah, Nate doing good Ooh, stuff there. Changes. Oh, Nate probably wasn't sure of the back Door throw combo. Oh. Oh, good, kick. It, good it's launch this time. Artsy Nate. Seeing a big switch here. That 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 previous match victory really doing something for him there. Whoa. All right. Doing repeat Three blows. Gets the counter hit. Stubby range and that goes for a slippery kick. So yeah. he gets it again. Gets him to the wall. This is big pressure. Oh, breaks the throw yeah. again. Now we do have Nate on the wall, though. Oh, got the boot. So much damage heard of Elf on the Shelf. <laughs> Just to get him out of the air, he's got to get this oh. round. Just oh. there goes the low. We tied, sir. We yep. tied. Well, uh, not wanting this to get away from him. Goes for the low. Yeah, good follow-up. Nice low TG. Nate takes him off his feet. That was a big whiff, but goes for Slippery Kicks. Gets mm -hmm. it anyway. Damage there. Slippery Kicks has been working out in Artsy's favor quite handily. Oh, Just another big counter. He's going to get this this time. Oh, oh walking nice. unblockable. That's the charge up. Yep. Doesn't duck the second hit. Rainbow. There we go. Puts him just outside of rage. Huh. Didn't seem to have Oh, he gets uh, it again, there. dude. No, I think he was just going for something oh, big. He's going to burn it. Is that going to catch him? And wow. Yep. That's enough to do the job. Armored through the transition into relax. Wow. <laughs> a big read by oh, Ola there. Wow. Both were unblockables. Okay. Breaks the throw. Yeah, he does. Ola making a statement right now. Tries to throw him. Gets Nate it broken. Doing, Nate doing really well on these blocks. Well, oh! I, he actually managed to, to backspace that unblockable just within centimeters. Oh my gosh. Good job. Hard to Nate. Got to win this round. He's got to survive. Mm -hmm. He's got the life lead right now, but that can change at the drop of a dime. <laughs> Ola fishing with the, uh, I'm guessing like back three or back four. <laughs> Becking out these lows here, and they're working in Archie's favor right now. Ooh, goes for the Ooh. twister. It doesn't work. Oh, that's a big that's one. A Gets himself one. tied up. Yeah. Double uh, Luigi. Yeah, either way. Who's gonna get this out? This is the last round to tell. One of these fellas is gonna go play. Uh, gonna go play. Oh, had a big whip there. He doesn't do a combo off of it. Gets oh, the sorry, armor with the sword block. Yeah, play Magic Eye. All right, checks him with the mid. Whoa. Low lows. Uh, Got uh, those. Little mini combo there uh, Ola. for a tail spin. <laughs> doesn't break that throw. Uh, is that a sign time. of things to come? Oh, Ooh, good roll. Get checks up. Checks the mid. Doesn't go with the low, but Ola quick oh. to challenge. Not a bad punish. We got oh. Rage on both. He uses the armor. Is this it? Oh my god. He manages to break it. Oh no, this is a terrible Whoa. fall apart. Arcsteen letting it go. He saw the Rage art. He could have tossed out anything. Ola. Oh, Ola taking it back. Woo. Victory almost bitten straight through the board. 
That was so close. Wow. That could have been anybody's match. That, yeah, that got nuts super fast. All right, let me type Very this Very intense match. At Artsy versus Magic Time. Uh, I'm not even sure if he's in the Discord, but yeah, that's whatever. Is he, is he young enough to know Discord? <laughs> that there Discord. I'll just, I'll just. Where did I, where did I type it out earlier? There it is. Man, we gotta get you organized, sir. I am organized. It's the, it's the other people. <laughs> it's the other peeps. They're the ones that are wrong. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Am I so out of touch? No. No, it's the children who are wrong. <laughs> oh, good stuff. All right. Um, let's see if we can get Donnie into this chat real quick. And uh, we will fetch your opponent while we are working on that. Well, that's Britty Spears. There he is. And uh, we will fetch your opponent while we are working on that. All right, you're definitely going to want to turn your speakers down. I just did. Okay. <laughs> What's up, man? And I could just commentate through Twitch. Uh, actually, let's see. Through here, right? Right, since you're in the Discord. He, he's you... in the Discord. You know what? I can send this to Discord. No, I mean, like, I'm just watching it on my iPad. I can just oh, you'll like, be so far I behind if behind. you commentate You know what that. I mean? Or I'm in front. You know what I'm talking about? Let me let me go ahead and stream in to Discord. Mm -hmm. uh, so I need to make one of these. And I need to make it big enough for you to see. And let me know when you we'll get this, into, folks. Uh, don't worry. Start. I don't. I don't want to start up when you're. Okay. All right, Brady. Yeah. All right. You guys are good. We can play. Yep. Okay. Uh, and yeah, Donnie, you can see this. I can see it. Can you still hear me? Yes. All right. Sweet. Oh, did you just toss me some some bits there, Doom? Oh, five bucks. Oh, thank you, bro. Oh, man, dude. Like, yeah, Sluch dude, came dude. up to the Cleveland scene a couple weeks ago to come to our big tournament. And he ran me over there, too. Like, I was not shocked <laughs> playing him online. I was just super upset with myself because I choked and I dropped the one combo that would have won my round. I'm like, oh, no. <laughs> but uh, it's all good. He's... Dude, that man... I've got good vibes all year. I don't know how he does it with three kids, man. I got one kid. <laughs> <laughs> and I hate him. I just throw him against the wall all day. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, children. <laughs> Dude, I'm just happy I got my Pepsi right now because we got Go Pup in Cleveland now. It's like, I don't got to go out to Drug Mart or anything or CVS. I'm like, oh, yeah? I'm out of toilet paper. Now we'll go puff them, not. <laughs> Let's see, 7B, Mr. J. Get ready for the next battle, battle, battle. battle. All so right. The uh, versus yep. Kermit's. So yeah, uh, as much as as much fun as we make of uh, Sloosh and his raven-haired uh, waifus, uh, put put any sort of ninja garb on a lady and uh, Mr. Jail player. This, <laughs> this is a waifu battle indeed. Mm -hmm. we got a, we basically got a Lisa right here who's like a poking monster, and when she's got her chainsaws out, she's plus on everything, so she's yep, really yep. hard to deal with. And then we got Kunimitsu, so she's gonna try to 
like space her out. So this is just going to be a spacing battle in the end. Let's, it's all going to be based on who has better spacing. All right. Sorry, late to that. All right. Oh, and we've so dressed right up as well. We've got Plague Doctor. Our remove versus uh, Vegas here. Showgirl. I don't know. <laughs> We got a plague doctor versus a maskless Kuni Mitsu now. Oh yeah, it's it's off. It's a good punish right there. Ooh. Oh, you did you miss the punish on the hop kicks? Yep. Yeah, pretty pretty kind of losing ground here. Yeah, nice getup plan be though. Against Kuni Mitsu because she can choose when she wants to stop that string right there, and if mm -hmm. you press button, you're getting the counter hit. It's not as bad as like a counter hit launcher, but you're still taking damage. Oh, good throw break right there. Wall. Oh, that's the wall combo. Do stuff. Nope. Alright, good punish right there. Bye. Ooh, Hyper Ooh. These are just two characters that are very hard to deal with. You don't know the matchup, but we're looking at two exactly. people that know what they're doing, though, so. Yeah, there, there ought to be a lot of good back and forth on this. Was Hyper Jewel in the last uh, matchstick melee? I think I played him in a. Uh, round one of losers and i was about to get one game on him and he, he rage guarded me <laughs> <laughs> that that would not surprise me at all oh okay oh that was a good whip punish right there which but, Kuni but yeah. is going to be doing a lot of she got her ninja skills but yeah mr j is uh Ooh, blocked the low frequent uh frequent participant in, in magic melee tuesday nights oh i'll be here every month with psn one i'm just glad i'm not going oh and two again this week mm. this month <laughs> Mm, good low parry right there. How far are we going to take her, though? It's a small stage, so we can get... Yeah, got to the wall. Look at that. Confirmed off the low hit right there. You know, was Britney Spears was playing Marduk, right? Yes. La yeah, I last really, time they were on. I'm sure. really surprised he didn't stick with Marta. Uh, oh, good break. Damn! That is a care good job, Piper Jewel. Did Marta's something, did something land at, at, on the ground? Like, did I see that correctly? Yeah, her arm fell on the ground. Oh, she's over, okay. She, she actually has a throw where she takes her head off and puts it in your hands and it explodes and they make like a really comedic like cartoon look or whatever when they're doing that. Mm -hmm. It's really funny. But yeah, Marduk is a great character because even in this season with the extended health bar, uh, when you're playing Marta, I mean, you have the ability to kill somebody, like, without walls very quickly, which is, I really like walls because I play law. Because if I have DSS, oh, I sure. can mix you up with the wall. Yeah, yeah. And keep pro at wall damage. But Marta really only has to capitalize on two mistakes, and then you're dead. He's, he's like Paul and Miguel in terms of, like, they hit, like, a truck. And then you have the tackle, which can go into three different things. So if he uses his right arm, it's a one break. If he uses his left arm, it's a two break. And, and uh, if they see you breaking the throws a lot, they're going to throw one plus two out. They're going to hit you with that. It does less damage, but it's a lot harder to break because nobody ever expects it. Because you get greedy when you're in that tackle position, you know? And you're just like, oh, I'm about to get all this damage until you don't. But then, like you said, like there's the get-up options where if they're getting up and you throw the tackle out at the right time, it's just GGs, basically. Hmm, apparently I'm echoing on the stream. Hmm, I wonder why. So you shouldn't be. I'm on my computer right now, so. <laughs> well, no, like, Doom, Doom is saying that I'm doing it. I'm not sure mm -hmm. why. Okay. Looks like we got a wall of stage this time. Like I said, Marduk doesn't need walls. So let's see what we go we got here. Now, this is this entire game is gonna be based off spacing, and if uh yeah, there's a launch for Marta. See we're already at half health just off one combo. So if he makes one more mistake, Marduk gets one down forward one off and launches him. That's it. Hmm. 
low hit right there. That shouldn't be. Can you still hear me all right? Yeah, I can hear you. Did, did the sound go out? Oh, yeah, just for a sec. Okay. No worries. Oh, boy. Whoa. Oh, this is not good. Oh, one good whiff. That's it. <laughs> got to be careful throwing those ray darts out. It's all about a hard read or else you're getting punished hard. All right, let's try that. All right. Britney Spears is really good at chipping away damage. He's staying on the ground. He's like, come and get me. Oh, good KO. Oh my. Oh, big KO indeed. All right. Oh, the names are backwards too now. Got so oh, no. absorbed with other things. Let's see, Piper Jewel. Let's see if Piper Jewel can get this match right here. It's looking good in his favor right now. Okay. That was a good punish right there. Hmm. I'm surprised how good he is with uh, Kunimitsu like right away. He must have played her in Tag 2 and 6. I mean, yeah, I, I think he got just back in on it. Not sure. She's a fantastic character, that's for sure. Yep. Especially because she's just a little bit different than her last iteration, so... It's kind of like she's legacy, but at the same time, you're still learning something a little bit new. Exactly. Oh! All I know is I just wish that her kunai was a little bit more punishable. All you can get is a 10-frame punish off on it. You might be able to get an 11-frame punish off, but... Not many characters have 11 frame punishes. And that's over right there, because he got the one. Like I said, yep. make one mistake against Marduk and you're dead. Yeah, he a big From beefy boy. All right, so while we're in the interim here, I just want everybody to to, to confirm. I got reports that my my audio is echoing. That my microphone is echoing. I just want to confirm or deny that things are okay. All right, we're good now? All right. Okay. Okay, we're good now. I... Yeah, they say you're good now. Okay. I sure wish somebody would have told me sooner. <laughs> I mean, it wasn't happening like when I was playing at Slooch and uh, A Chef. Yeah, uh, I think it was. I think it was Vaughn. <laughs> is A Chef a Columbus player by chance? He is actually. He's usually okay, one of I, our I, uh, one of our Street Fighter players. I uh, I think I ran into him at Raj last year when I went to the tournament. Uh, there, I think he might have been there. If he was, if he, he was still was. playing Lucky Chloe back then, then yes. All right, we got we got to make this easier on everybody. Lamont, do you have a Discord that you could be like using to talk to, into the into the Tekken channel? <laughs> I just wish I didn't have three different usernames, you know, because like on on Twitch I'm Yo Prince, on PlayStation I'm Renegade, but on this I'm just Donnie. Yeah. Let's see. How about I do this? He only uses floppy disks. That's hilarious. You know, if anybody was, you know, I could tell that that Vaughn Doom's a little bit older because he said floppy disks, because everybody younger would say, oh, the save button. Mm-hmm. You know, tablet. I think it's art artist C Nate. I can't yeah. remember how the rest of it goes though. <laughs> See how round two goes. All right, so pretty back in the player one spot, and yep. Now Jay has to adapt. Round one. Fight. Oh. Ooh, good counter hit yeah, right there. Off, right off the bat. Straight to the wall. Cool. Mm -hmm. Drop the wall combo. Oh, oh good punish. Might have been off Here we go again. 
Right there with the launcher. Nice. Okay. Break it. No, nope. oh, like I said, he knows he's so he's much go damage. Plus two instead. Actually, that was the least amount of that. That one actually has the least amount of damage out of all of them. I think he did that on purpose because he wanted the damage. <laughs> that's that's a little spooky. Uh. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm kind of surprised that uh, Mr. J didn't go to uh, Master Raven for the third game. Well, the funny thing about Marduk is, is almost everything he does is minus. Like even there's even moves where he hits you and he's minus on hit even. Wow. So, but to make up for that, you know, he has like this insane damage. Like I said, right. he hits Whoa. like a truck. That catch was nuts. Mm-hmm. He's really good. Unfortunately, Britty is uh still in the winner's position here. Match mm -hmm. point. And he's already going to the wall, it looks yeah. like. Oh no, drop Try the combo. Oh, there we right. go. We got the Oscar style uh, back three. <laughs> oh, he, that was a good duck right there. Oh, there we go. Get to the wall. A little bit of damage. A little, a little bit. bit now let's see if you can get him in a mix up. Oh, they switched position. Yeah, definitely. now now uh, Jay needs to start rotating towards the center of the screen. Absolutely, because Marduk is absolutely dangerous at the wall. Like I said, he's already like got him in a vortex. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh this is trouble. Good oh, get out broke, of that grab, though. You broke the ground grab. That's yep. good. Oh, shut down that dash in. Nice blue stuff, Ooh. though. Oh, I hope he gets something off oh, this. Oh, he, oh, is he oh. going to do it? Oh, oh you got to be careful here. Mm-hmm. One oh, good middle. Oh, the do angles. It. Oh, he, he wow, missed the Wow, the ducks are right real. Oh, oh, quick shot to the nuts, and Jay is in it still. Buff that. I don't know if I'm allowed to say, so I'm just going to say it's a wiener jab. I don't know if I'm allowed <laughs> to swear. <laughs> oh, good throw break right there. <laughs> Willie's not a swear. I don't know. I said wiener. <laughs> not Willie. Really. Oscar Meyer, bro. Let's All right. see. Ooh, we're not going to get to the wall, but we're going to have good OP oh. right here. And we're already in the tab. Yep. Let's see if he guesses right now. Like I said, it looks like Mr. J here oh my good God. at throw break, so he's throwing one plus two at him every single time. Yeah. So I've, I have really can't not... make any more He can't make any more mistakes right now. No. Nope. I don't know well. if you noticed. The reason the reason why he was uh, he was staying still right there when Marduk was on the ground is because Marduk is like the only character in the game, other than the bears, that can hit <laughs> you while he's on his stomach facing you. So I think he was fishing for a parry right there. But not it looks the like bears. <laughs> Oh, man. But yeah, no, that was cool. Mm-hmm. All right. Well, that does put our good buddy, uh, Mr. J, into losers. Yep. Uh, but we can talk about what will ha happen out there while we load up Subway Wang and Fire Kung Fu Hero. Oh, what's there to say? He he got more reads. That's, uh... <laughs> Marduk is a, a much tougher character to fight overall. I mean, tackle by itself is a big deal. Mm -hmm. you, you've got a you've got a lot of uh, of things to navigate, and you know part of you know Kunimitsu style is poking. working on conditioning and poking. Mm -hmm. And you've got a character that that has a, a a much longer reach on some things. And I was pressing in certain situations where I couldn't or where I shouldn't. So when you were waiting at the end there, like I know, like you, you're obviously you have a lot more years of Tekken than I do. Were you like uh, looking for a low parry at the end there when he was on his stomach? I saw. I that actually he was kind of waiting there. I actually had an idea of he was going to toss something out and I was going to rage art it, mm -hmm. and nothing ended up happening. In fact, you saw me do like a palm push because I was expecting something to come up that I could crush with a rage art, and that motion is uh, one plus two. Um, but then it's down, not forward one plus two like I had. So I messed that up. I was I was a little spooked in a couple of areas, but um, I'll, I'll I'll get more run back and I'll, I'll definitely want to play Brady some more. I mean, you definitely play game. super solid. I mean, you guys both play really solid, so that's really good. And did we play at the last match stick off stream? I think uh, we did. I was playing maybe? Lost because I didn't. Did you play Kunimitsu last time? Uh. I know I've been playing Kunimitsu quite a bit since she came out, so it's very possible. My my memory on a couple things is a little hazy right now. <laughs> <laughs> I'm tired. From that beating? No. <laughs> God damn, that was rough. <laughs> yeah, just uh, just tell me when I'm up next because like I'm on the stream right now. Sorry, a as, as a verbal competitor, most of my moves activate off of OTG. <laughs> Oh, that's 
true. <laughs> like I said, I only I only play Tekken, so and I've only been mm. playing for like a year, so I met like Johnny and at a uh, like Comatose at Raj last year, and he told me he's like, "Oh, are you from like the Cleveland area?" I'm like, "I sure am." He's like, "We got this new place up there called One Life to play," and I'm like, "Okay," and I've just been going there like ever he starts, since. Yeah, he's just like, "Are you a villager?" <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, I that. He says, they say that a lot in the Cleveland like Facebook chat. Dude, he says it all the time. <laughs> Disagree with him about anime? You're a villager. <laughs> Dust, dusty villager is what he said. Yeah, that's Johnny. All right, bro. They're we fun, love you, they're, Johnny. They're all hilarious up there. Like when they're when the you locals goof. are actually happening, they are just absolutely just at it with each other. You hear some of the funniest stuff you'll ever hear. Damn, Von Doom saying Johnny got villager ass dreads. What? Oh, That's no. the oof. damn. I, they, yeah, I got I. Oof. I give him a savage medal over. <laughs> All right, you guys, you guys go, go on and talk about this. All right, talk so him, talk basically what yourself. we're doing right here, like I said before, Paul is another one of those characters where you get two mistakes against Paul. That's it. If he gets you the wall and he has wall pressure, that's it. So knowing the matchup is very, very imperative here. Now, when you're online, a lot of his moves that have pushback are punishable, but because you're online, they're a lot harder to punish. Um, Lee, on the other hand, is an absolute... Mm. I don't know what you're doing. Oh, blue shit. So... It's, it's Subway all tossed like, it all out there. He managed to take that round. Yeah, we're definitely going to see some character knowledge test here. Subway has uh, traditionally been playing Leo, but he's using using Paul. Yeah, Super Fire Leo. Kung Fu. Yeah, Super Leo, and Fire Kung Fu has uh, traditionally st stuck with 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 a lot of Lei. Yeah, it seems though um, like he's a he's a character purist from what I've seen. Oh, like you gotta really like commit yourself to somebody like me. You got like 207 moves or something like that. A lot, yeah, a lot Ooh. of stances, a lot of moves that come out of each one. They switch sides. <laughs> Oh, man, it's just to block the mid, though. Subway uh, on his last life, he gets Razor Rushed. Well, one of my favorite parts about Lee is that, like, you get a character that can carry you a little bit, but you get that reward after you learn the character. Like, this character is not easy to play just because of how much you have to do. And in terms of chipping, he's been absolutely king at it. But if he, um, like I said, if you get caught in the vortex, you know... That's it. <laughs> Seen it right there. Seven golden letters on Fire Kung Fu. Seven Two golden one. pandas. <laughs> oh, they're both going for mid-high strings here. So the punish from Paul is going to be very, uh, very important here. I'm going to say. Oh, he dropped him. his combo right there. Oh. Tries to go for the hop kick. Doesn't work out. Trey says, I got one of my oh, own, dropped, but I dropped the combo. combo Ooh, checks Great him with the high there. there. He's trying to challenge it. Oh, nice punish. You're about to, I oh, almost my 30 seconds Here in. Here we go. For combo. Wall, but are we going to win after we get the wall? Big damage there. Oh, wow. All goes for the side switch mm. and, and completely takes it. Woo! Chunky damage there. Fire Kung Fu Hero. I feel like Leia would work very well against Lei just because she has that back sway. Very possible if uh, Subway's feeling it, uh, that that switch may very well happen. Okay. All right. So quick update. Looks like Artsy Nate is taking it over. Uh, it's Magic Time and Losers, which actually means that uh, Donnie, it's uh, you and Nate and Losers. Okay. So if I you will... want to uh, oh, throw actually. that match together. Mm -hmm. Um, so is he RC Nate on PSN? I'm gonna add him. I, I believe it is spelled exactly the way that this uh, that, that it looks in the in the bracket. Sounds good. All right. Well, I am gonna hop out of here and then I will catch you back in a little bit if I lose. <laughs> uh, all the best of luck to you. Thank you. Mm -hmm. So, Mr. J, it is down to you and it is down to me. Yes. I've waited for this moment. Pistols at three paces. For all my life. <laughs> you know what show you would probably enjoy? Which Aunt, one? Tell Aunt, me. Auntie Donna's uh, Big Ol' House of Fun. I've heard of that show. I've thought about watching it. It was just on thought. So we do see the switch. Subway. Mm hmm. Deciding Paul is not the answer for this. Going <laughs> for the comfort the food. 
<laughs> yeah. Paul is not the way. But yeah, uh, definitely check out Auntie Donna's on Netflix. It's only six episodes. It's a really well shot, like sketch comedy series. Just like three Australian or British dudes can't really tell doing their thing. <laughs> can't really tell. Can't really tell. I'm not gonna <laughs> lie. All right, so we are at the castle. Oh, at the castle. At the castle. And uh, yeah, Subway's getting in there. Yeah, so there's a pretty, pretty big Ooh. amount of oh, big launch there. I was gonna say he was doing a very, very big amount of, of pokes that were just whittling away at Fire Kung Fu. A lot, a lot more comfort in this character than what we just saw with his ball. Okay, stomp. Yep. Plus frames. Ooh, that was a big challenge there. Fire not being on the right end of that. At the wall, he's already enraged. We're barely 10 seconds in. And he checks him with the low. Get stomped out of the roll. Where are you going, son? Subway quickly going up 2 0. Still down a game, but it's looking, looking very likely he's going to tie it. Oh, Doesn't yeah. break the throw. Oh, oh, oh. Drunken Man goes low, staggers it. Uh. Ooh, Kung Fu working him into a corner. He's still got the possibility to do a perfect. He doesn't fall for it. Still whittling him in down, and oh! he does. Returns the favor. He's the, not out of this. The range on that was huge. And but Fire Kung Fu was feeling himself there, but he gets launched for a combo. Chunky damage by Subway. I feel like that's that's probably the advantage of like to lay players is like, yeah, you have to do a lot of work to learn how to play him, but guess what? Your opponent also has to learn a lot of has to do a lot of work to learn how, how to fight, to fight him. Yeah, Leo is a, a criminally underrated character. Mm -hmm. Leo is very good. And Subway, oh, Subway coming Subway through. Quickly tying it up. Very quickly. Going off the boots. I shall vacate this honored position as Subway Wang's opponent. <laughs> oh, so you say, so you say. Yeah. The... <sighs> Someday my PS5 will come. Someday. <laughs> Someday. Someday. Dude, I totally got, I, I got, uh, tricked i guess okay so read an article that said that um somebody in south korea found a shipping container full of like uh, full, with containing 500,000 uh 3000 series nvidia cards uh, and uh, like like yeah uh like this the 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 manifest got like lost or corrupted or or whatever and i found them and uh I was like, oh, hell yeah, time to flood the market, get these scalpers, like, taken care of. And then come to find out that somebody uh, wrote that for the Spanish equivalent of April Fool's Day. Oh, my God. I was so pissed. <laughs> Damn. Nobody suspects the Spanish Inquisition. Nobody suspects you. <laughs> Their chief weapon is surprise. That is just a massive amount of surprise and disappointment. Because yeah. it sounds just... so credible, too. Like, I like I believe it. <laughs> you know what that's like? That's like the 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 massive disappointment we all have done where you learned that there is such a thing as Hershey's powdered chocolate milk, mm. only to find out that eating it by the spoonful is not nearly as good as you thought it would be. Oh, hex no. <laughs> Like, just a superb amount of betrayal. <laughs> Getting launched by our Kung Fu hero. Tried to jump in there. Jackie Chan goes for the low. That's a big one. He could have got more damage there. Punch parry. Subway Punch missing the follow-up. Gets oh. poked down by our Kung Fu up by one. Remember, this is the first to two. Yeah. Need this game to advance. Ooh. Doesn't fall for the low. Nope. Hop kick didn't Ooh. work. No avail. It's the back Damn. way. A lot of damage. Follows up with the confirm. Damn. I like it. Wow. Like a ton walls. of damage here. We're just riding Almost along. Almost got it from wall to wall. That was nasty. Ooh. Subway making a mission to come back. Fire Kung Fu tried his best, but gets kicked to the dome. 1-1. Yep. One, one. <laughs> what was that old skit? Like, boot to the head. 
Oh, I remember boots on the ground, but oh, speaking of boots on the ground, yeah. drop combo. Whoa, the stance switch. Taking Subway's boots off the ground. Whoa. Saved oh. himself from getting low comboed. Hell sweet. Oh, another one. 15 seconds. They are throwing things out. Razor rush. Okay, gets low parried. Oh. Subway to the wall. Back this is not where you want to be. This is your home now. Oh, he oh. turned it around. Get stuck. That was cinematic AF. Wow. Fire Kung Fu on the verge of taking this subway. Uh, that was Gotta most, make something happen. That was the most anime thing I've ever seen. For real, that just, was really cool. This blue stuff <laughs> getting just, just left over. Yeah. The madness, man. It's like time for my ultimate and technique. Head, huh? Whoosh, 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 whoosh. <laughs> subway hell sweeping it. Is it a duology? <laughs> oh, doesn't get it. Oh, the drunk boxing. Checks the move there. Good punish. This is a terrible place oh. to be. He breaks the throw. They switch sides. Subway got to take this. Getting hit at the wall. <gasps> oh, that's a big oh. combo. Fire trouble, trouble, gonna trouble. Just barely take it. Oh, oh. hop kick. Subway, oh. are you serious? Oh, oh no. no. He whips the blue this stuff. This fires the wind. This is fires the wind. He goes underneath it. <laughs> Subway <laughs> in it. Oh, my God. I'm kind of surprised he ducked that punch. Oh, he gets counter hit it, though. Oh, he tries to punish it, but uh, well, they're, they've got to be rattled. Does it break the throw? Seeing all the strings he's out here. Oh, oh my gosh. At this point, it's whoever can land the first hit. This is tense. Yeah, 15 seconds yeah, in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cross chop. Oh my god, ooh, Subway ooh. with punish that. That's so marginal. It's launched! Oh uh -oh. no! Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. damage. Is it over? Oh, it's the wall. over! Mm. So watch the cut screen. Oh my god. Are you kidding me right now? Damn, son. My heart is, is about to leap out of my chest. <laughs> Holy shit. Yeah, that was... Ooh. That was woo. Breathe, man. Need to breathe. Uh, yeah, seriously. Woo. Sorry, I'm what also you, I'm also monitoring the, the, the I'm also monitoring the Somebody send an invite, you you goofs. I had everything you want out of Tekken. Action. Romance. <laughs> desire. Red Robin. Yum. <laughs> Yum. Yum. <laughs> Just say that from now on. Yep. Renegade. Okay, we got that settled. Um, all right, so Subway Wang now needs to play a chef off off uh, stream. So let's set that as well. A chef versus at Subway. Off stream, please. Pleaser? Nah, we ain't selling we ain't selling sexy shoes here tonight. Okay. Uh, that means we go to the top of winners, and the semifinal is semifinal one is going to be competitive casual versus Ola. See a bloodbath here. Mm hmm. There's Ola. Then deep dive into the the people who are online but appear to not be. There we go. <laughs> Yo, Prince. Okay, so wait. Yo, Prince is Donnie? I, I, it's, it's too much to keep up with, man. Zola. Mm-hmm. Amir Mor Morethi? Hi. <laughs> Hello. I'm gonna have the Do You Love Me song in my head oh, now. Yep. Do you love what? me? Dude, that's on my timeline if you want to see like the downfall of the human civilization. Once the once the and robots have mastered rhythm and, and dance, we're done. 
that robot has better moves and rhythm than many people I know. <laughs> oh god, they even got the robo dog in there. Holy sh! You like it like this? Yeah. They did running, folks. man. Yo, what's up? Not much. What up, Mountain Man? Mountain Man. <laughs> you mean uh, the Fire Kung Fu Hero? Yeah, I'm out of the mountain. Oh yeah. <laughs> Call me the fireman. That, 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 nah, that, that. Nah. But I'm on fire, yeah. though. Yeah, you got to play uh, A Chef. No, Subway Wang has to play A Chef. Oh, oh, that's right. Fire Kung Fu One. My bad. Yeah. Oh man, wait. You just you just tune out that that batch with me in it. Come on, man. Mm -mm. Hurts my feelings. Oh, I was there. I was watching it. I commentated it. Oh, uh, okay. He did that. Now shit. you got to play Birdie, though. All right, so Ola and competitive casual. Thank God I can pretty much start typing any time during the start of a Tekken Online match. <laughs> and I'll have plenty of time to do it, spelling mistakes and all. Hey, doing God's hey. work. Doing God's work. Is that like from the, the reboot DMC? Uh, What? <laughs> I thought, I thought you said doing God's work. That, that uh, there was a boss in uh, the reboot DMC that, that that says that all the time. Oh, Devil May Cry. Yeah, the reboot uh, one. Oh, okay. The, Wait, not the, the main one. one. It's the one with the with the with the the guy has like a emo hair. I mean, that's all of them though. Well, okay, he's twice emo. <laughs> Buzz cut emo. That's probably put it. Uh, that's Dante, I think. Yeah, but that's the Ninja Theory's uh, Devil May Cry, not the mainline Devil May Cry. Ooh. Oh, he knows that one. Yeah. Oh, he's so back on video. <laughs> Competitive casuals like, how clutch, dare you? Clutch, clutch, cancel. <laughs> wow. That was an excellent read. Okay, unblockable. Good punish on the thrown out armor. Whoop. Breaks Rainbow Road. Yeah. Oh, that's a close float. I thought he could have gotten something from there. Running too. Mm. Uh oh. Oh, that could be a jab. Yep. Oh, one knows. Oh, He's got a fraction of life. He's got to make the, something happen here. To the walls. Oh, did a cross up. That's unfortunate. <laughs> oh, did you a cross up, mate? Now, these two are related, right? Uh, Kunimitsu, this is the original Kunimitsu's daughter. Oh, okay. And Kunimitsu really, really wants the sword that Yoshimitsu has. Oh. There is, like, a big, huge story to it, I guess, but that's the premise of it. Ooh. Seven gold letters, though. That's also a good story. Casual Competitive casual. Yep, that's why she says, I'll be taking your weapon. Yep, give me that sword or I'll have to hurt you. <laughs> I mean, I technically already did, but... The cutest thief ever. Eh. Give me your life force. I demand it. That would be horrifying if <laughs> Kunimitsu said that in that moment. <laughs> Instead of like, thanks, she was just like, give me your life. Dude, that... So, uh, have you ever seen the Animatrix? Yes, I have actually. The, it's been the, forever. The 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 part that always like spooked me the most was when they were telling the back like the, the full backstory and how the robots rose up and like where the robot like goes in and signs like the piece of cord or whatever and then goes, yeah. Give us your flesh, we demand it, and then like everything explodes and I'm like, Well, I'm not sleeping ever, like again. <laughs> Does make you kinda of horrified thinking about something autonomously, you know, just Yeah. Figuring out like, yep, the best approach is no more humans by mm. Oh, yeah, and it wasn't like the other robots fighting the other robots, and they take apart the cockpit, and there was like a person in there, and then the, yeah. the person gets impaled after that. Well, there's that, and then there's like they cut a dude in half and start like poking his brain and make them like laugh and cry, and I'm just like, no, thank you! <laughs> Happy holidays! Fully responsible for my own nightmares, thank you very much. I don't need this, this G fuel. Ah, <laughs> uh, G fuel. It's like drinking apple juice before bed, and you're going to have nightmares. Mm.
Ola sticking with the Yoshimitsu. Yeah. Showing full committal today. I like it. Competitive casual kind of uh, took that rather convincingly, though. Ola did put up quite a fight. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Sanjo this. Going for the for the purple. Oh, Shoji sama. <laughs> Oh, jeez, son. Oh, doesn't fall for the wall standing three. Nope. Full crouch. Yeah, Kunimitsu. Oh, sidestep. Oh, no, that's a that's a hard counter hit to get. Yeah. Kunimitsu out here beating up Danger Mouse or some shit. I don't know. <laughs> I don't listen to tech now. <laughs> oh, punish is the QCF1. Hey, I like techno, thank you very much. Ooh, I thought that was going to hit. Yep. Oh, uh -oh. the armor. This is it. Oh, boy. Tech that's going to hurt tech a lot. Tech is basically the first generation dubstep. Oh no, that's rough. Going for the yeah. big stuff and loses it. Wow, nice they start. Casual. They exchange counter hits there. Crazy revenge straight away. Yeah, we got we Punching got kunai. Quarter circle one. Yeah, got the kunai out. Doesn't doesn't get anything from it though. It's a tough one to block. It yeah. is a uh, jab punishable, but you have to be close enough for it. Ola checking the ankles. Mm. Oh, that's a dangerous move. At least what negative 15 say? on that last hit. Dangerous. Danger risk. <laughs> Good punish on the armor that whiffed. Competitive casual just kind of dictating the pace of this. Yeah, a little bit. Ola's got to make something happen here. He's got the red dress on. Oh, that was a good sidestep. Side step. If he had to bet, that had been a little tighter, he would have gotten the punish. Ola's going to have to do something here. He's got yeah. less than seven seconds. Goes oh! to the suicide, and oh my god, it worked! Ola may establishing himself. You think you're going to get comfo One comfortable? Two. Drops the combo. That really unnerved competitive. He's got to get back into this. Yeah, dude. Oh, Breaks good the throw. Break. That's a good victory. Yeah, yeah. Goes to the 1-1, one, one, doesn't fully punish it. Get in there with that Tonto girl. Oop. Oh, get the last hit of that. I don't think he was going to do it. Nope. Armor. Takes him off his feet into the red stuff. Ooh. Checks him on that. The yeah. down punch. I like that. Oh. Ooh, good break oh. there. It's gonna, it's Once gonna again. Hit. Wow, Ola, two for two on that. Drops the combo. That's so big. Yeah, 30 that's seconds a problem. In. Oh, my gosh. The Bing down bong. forward one into a low poke. Competitive casual. Match point. Ola really gonna have to change something. Doesn't break the one grab. This is his chance going for going for set play. Checks the high. Checks it again. Said you need your receipt. <laughs> Said I got one too. Goes for the low. That's a big oh. one. Manages to kick him away. Yeah, I say Ola making back some good ground here. Wow, but, the but, big pickup. But, oh, missed that knee. Uh oh, uh. Ola gonna get it again. Uh. This is a chance. Three for three. Doesn't want to drop this. Tying it up 2-2, two, two. Ola. Can he break this? That's a tall order, competitive casual. Taking his space, but not letting him get away too much. Capitalizing every little minuscule mistake. Good backdashing, Ola. Yep. Almost at half-life. No. Ooh, oh, goes with the unblockable. You can't block it. Drop the combo. Oh, he's, he's going to punish, punish that. On the knee. Yeah. Oh, oh, nice sidestep by out. Ola. Breaks the throw, not Ooh. checking the ankles. It's a counter hit. Don't think that was the button. Oh, he gets the knee, though. Yeah, he does. That's going to be a good party starter. Competitive getting through the wall almost. Doesn't get it all the way. There's the slide Ola's again. got the red dress. I don't think. Uh, uh, yep, no, 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 no. <laughs> he bet his match life on it. Ola going down. Casual said, fool me once, shame on you. Fool me seven or eight times. <laughs> and shame on you and me. Shame on you and me. Oh, Gave him the man. GGs and left. GGs. I'm back. All right, so Casual with the two to one. Oh, sorry, no, Ola didn't get a game. Never mind. Uh, so Ola goes to the loser's side. Unfortunately, no opponent just yet. Uh, now we are on to Britty Spears and Fire Kung Fu Hero. Oh boy, here we go. Shit. I guess I guess I gotta hop off and focus. Yep. Yep, indeed. Britty, 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 Wait, what am I missing? I'm gonna take this one. Wait, no, there it is. I'm just illiterate. Fire Kung Fu Hero. All right. 
Illiterate ginger. Half ginger. Half ginger. Oh, yeah, it's just the beard oh, down. It's, oh, it's just so the, you know it's, we'll do the drop. We'll do the drop of blood for black people without that. I see how they <laughs> racist. Oh, I thought you were talking about me. Yeah, you. Huh. <laughs> I'm only half ginger. <laughs> only half ginger. It's true. My hair's blonde. And my beard's red. God. I have an error in my L33 gene. You have an error. Wow. Of all the ways you could describe that, hey, I'm just like a snowflake. I'm not, I'm unique in my own way. <laughs> you call out the most science-based difference ever. <laughs> it makes me a better streamer. <laughs> Is that what causes red hair? <laughs> what, being a streamer? No, like the <laughs> LJ42 <laughs> thing you're talking about. Oh, yeah, the, 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 the gene, link, yeah. The gene? Yeah, the gene, the gene should have given me, uh, you know, red hair all over but uh yeah it's just uh yeah it crapped out halfway up the face Not the cranial that, region yeah. evaded it yep. <laughs> i guess my girlfriend has the lj 42 gene or whatever <laughs> my girlfriend is a redhead <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna be sound something completely this is his, his own private game of telephone and it's gonna sound something completely different by the time he gets it back to his girlfriend <laughs> Oh my god. It's like, baby, did you know that you've got the, um, got the, the, the RJD2 6000 gene all fucked up? <laughs> that LED technology, that's why it's so red. Exactly. I got messed up hard <laughs> by that ball player, too. I got beat up real bad. <laughs> Artsy Nate. Oh. Uh. All right, we are ready to go. Oh, that's right. I forgot it was a uh, death mask. Uh, Alicia. Ooh, can you check the low? Who do you think has the the matchup advantage in this one? I've never seen this matchup in my life. Typically, these exchanges have have traditionally gone Brady's way, but uh, Fire Kung Fu has uh, come a long way with his Lee. Lay, I should say. So this is really going to come down to both of them making the proper reads, not getting traits like that. First round going to Fire Kung Fu, though. It's brought out of the air. Small combo. Oh, gets him with the wild standing two. The big uppercut. Oh, tried to go for a mix-up there. He doesn't fall for it, though. Small damage, but better than that, but gets the rocket kick. Ooh, catches him with the elbow. Round quickly switching to Brady's favor. Boom. Damn. Using the arm rocket. Damn. That was Ooh, that set maneuver. Four. The disrespectful follow-up. <laughs> that was straight Ooh, up. He was going to do the other unblockable rocket. Oh, my God. This is a madman. That was straight up the, the Marvel Sentinel. <laughs> Ooh, goes for the rocket kick again. Mm. Gets the punish. Fire Kung Fu catches him in the mix-up. This is going to kill him, yes. 2-1 Fire Kung Fu. Lei is such a cool Ooh. character in the end, though. It's like, can you really even be mad if you lose against him? Because, like, the Aww. person you're playing against puts in so much work. Seeing it right now, but Brady on the on the verge of getting a good amount of damage from that low parry. Mm -hmm. Shines the shoes. No generic throw break. Woo. That was generic. Ooh, not in the rear. Oh, yeah. Oh, manages to back up from that. Doesn't Magic bite pixel. on the mid. Ooh, ooh guess he ooh, drops ooh. it. Oh, oh, he tries no. twice to ah, catch him. No, no return on investment. Oh, two, these two. names are backwards. I'm dumb. Brady getting armored there. Catches the whiff punish. Got jammed out of the freaking thing, but gets a launch instead. Is that the chainsaws? I don't need them. <laughs> Oh, just for chilling out. Oh, big whiff on the up forward three. Ooh, oh, catches him again. Boop, That's boop, the boop. second time that combo dropped. Yo, get the tail with the get up this? rocket. Oh. Whoa, doesn't fall for that pressure, but it gets caught Yo. by the armor anyway. Yo. All Didn't kinds of chainsaws. Brady Spears cutting his way back. <laughs> Cutting and clawing to the top of the heap. Ripping sawing, and tearing. Sawing through the Rip and tear. Rip and tear, baby. 
I'll bet Fire Kung Fu Hero has huge guts. <laughs> oh, guts. That's a very weird thing to discuss. About them guts. Jabs, hooks, uppercuts. You'll feel it when it impacts up your guts. Oh, no. <laughs> Please I don't. don't. Think I, I don't think you want to hear up your guts. <laughs> All right. Oh, that was a long Brittany. set. Okay, so it was... Um... It looks like Brittany likes to uh, bring out Marta when he's like, oh, I lost my first game. Like, I noticed that when he was playing uh, Mr. J, that after he lost with Elise, he's just like, I'm yeah. going to bring out Speaking of Mr. J... Character, again, well, I think it's, it's time for me to play, is that correct? Yeah, but I, I, doubt, I don't know if you can leave the lobby right now. Mm -hmm. uh, not at the moment, if it just oh, started. No. Yeah. You'd have to yeah. turn the PlayStation off. You're locked in. Or just exit the application. That's probably what I'm end up doing. <laughs> yeah, but I yeah, got it'll be it'll be Mr. J versus Subway Wang off stream. Yep, I'm gonna go do my thing. I'll uh, I'll talk to you guys in a bit. Alrighty. Good luck. Thanks. Good luck. Man, I got messed up by RC Nate's Paul. Yeah, I mean Paul just does that to people. Oh, no, that's, like, the worst matchup for me personally. Like, it's the one character that I'm just like, well, probably going to lose. So, mm -hmm. even when I'm playing, like, third Don Pauls, I'll, I'll run into a death fist every single time. Yikes. All right. Big start to this. Oh, yeah. Spears we'll taking here to the wall. Damn! Mm -hmm. <laughs> she got really good Oki when she has those chainsaws out, but she can't yeah, block when she say, has the chainsaws out. Skynet got, the. Uh... This guy that got crazy when I wasn't looking. Sawing through the competition, like I said. Like a hot chainsaw through everything. Mm-hmm. It's like those thousand degree knife videos. I love them. I was trying to tell my mom about that. She's like, that's stupid. I'm like, yes, but that's why we love them. <laughs> if you ever uh if you ever see the H3 H3 production spoof of it where he just goes, like, what are you guys doing? He's like, we're cut through stuff. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh no. That's uh, that's Tekken doing its thing. Email Harada. Oh no, communication error. Now here's the question: Did we lose everybody? Mm -hmm. No, oh, fire, no, fire, like, Kung Fu hero like still here. Mm -hmm. So it looks like Britney Spears lost connection. Dude, that's, that's just uh, that's just Tekken doing this. It's been doing this a lot ever since you know like COVID hit because. Right. My goodness. Everybody's online just playing right now. I mean, every yeah. day I'm playing Tekken with just like a bunch of people. <laughs> every day I'm playing Tekken, but also hustling. Oh yeah, dude. I, uh, <laughs> I've been hustling a lot, dude. I work every day, man. Like, <laughs> I'm killing it up here. All right, but we've, we've re-invited Brit, uh, Britney Spears. Uh, what was the round count? Because we'll want to get back to where they were. Uh, it was one. Uh, uh, Britney Spears had one and... Uh, Fire Kung Fu here at zero. Okay. Mm -hmm. yeah, I just I just make sure people in Cleveland got their party buses, man. <laughs> it's my hustle. <laughs> and I am just trying to build Taiwanese computers for Americans. <laughs> there you go. There we are. Okay, he's back in. Okay, so Britty already had a round under his belt in that in that game. Yeah, he did because he had that crazy, uh, that crazy start. Dude, thanks for letting me hop on commentary. Yeah, no problem, man. We ju we just don't get to hear Sluch's laugh this this month. Yeah. Wait, Britney Spears left. I wonder. I hope nothing's wrong with his internet. Oh, that would be the worst. Yeah, because he's a, uh, or I don't know, definitely hard hitter. That one. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, Britty, Britty's typing it out in the chat, or in the Discord. Yo, something is really wrong. I just, I just lost, I just lost the whole stream. <laughs> the whole stream, really? On your end, yeah, I'm not seeing anything right now. Huh? Because I'm, I'm, I'm showing solid connection through OBS. 
don't know. Maybe I'll just rejoin it real quick. Give me a second. I'm back. We're looking good. Okay. Yeah, I really gotta, I really gotta like message uh, Fire Kung Fu Hero every once in a while in the Discord because this, this is one matchup I gotta learn. I just have the worst tournament luck for some reason. Like, it's just like, oh, don't worry, nobody plays Lay, nobody plays Eliza, <laughs> nobody plays Lucky Chloe. It's like, guess who Renegade's popping into? Lucky Chloe, Lay, Anna, Nina, all the Kuma. I ran into a Kuma <laughs> tournament. I'm like, seriously? Nice. Something building really Taiwan. wrong. Yeah, that's building Taiwanese computer parts, huh? What yeah, um, I'm. It, it's such a weird thing, but apparently there's a market for it. it it's partly it's partly through Micro Center too, but yeah, it's um. Mm -hmm. uh, we're building parts into Lian Lee cases for uh, for uh, dedicated like hardline water cooling. Um, so you kind of get cool. a kind of get a project that's already like ha like like I don't know one third done. Um. And we're eventually working our way up to uh, custom builds. Water cooling. That sounds pretty neat. <laughs> it is, but at the same time, like, it, because well, it used to be such a big mystery, and then, of course, now I'm doing it for the job, so now it's less of a mystery and more of an annoyance. It also sounds like it could lead to a really big uh-oh at the same time. Well, we don't fill the we don't fill the reservoirs before we send out. That's good. Yeah. All right. So, Brady has indicated that he is ready for another shot. And we'll bring back in. I just put Gatorade in my water cooling tank because it has electrolytes, so I'd have more power. It's, it's what computers need. <laughs> it's what they crave. It's what they crave, that's right. <laughs> Did you know uh, the dude that made King of the Hill actually wrote that movie? Oh, Mike Judge? I have, I have yeah. yeah. Uh, you could I, you could tell me that uh, yeah like that or like Kevin Smith or just like a anybody really and I'd be like yeah yeah I sure. just couldn't believe how many things he has his hands in like, he's he prolific did, he did he did Office Space he did Idiocracy and mm -hmm. he, he also wrote um, Silicon Valley that's his show too huh mm -hmm. uh, and of course Beavis and Butthead and Daria did he do did he do Daria. Uh, he was at least involved, because Daria was a, Daria is a spinoff of Beavis and Butthead. Well, the one thing I really like about um, animation is that, like, a lot of people don't know this, but you remember Johnny Bravo? Sure. Everybody that is the, the head of the animation industry now started on Johnny Bravo. So, like, Butch Hartman was on Johnny Bravo. Seth MacFarlane was on Johnny Bravo. <laughs> uh, the dude, it was a writer-driven show. So, like, Butch Hartman did Fairly Odd Parents. Right. And uh, Danny Phantom. And Danny Phantom. And, uh, and then he became a giant douchebag. <laughs> did he? I, did he really? I don't know. I yeah, haven't followed his yeah. stuff lately. Oh man, that's that's rough to hear, man. It is. It's like it's like hearing like it's like when when you hear that like uh, Dean Kane or Kevin Sorbo is actually like a piece of crap. Oh man. And you're like, no, not Hercules and Superman. <laughs> oh really? I didn't know that was. Oh no. All right, let's see how this goes. And you yeah. said they're going to get back to where they were, so uh, Fire Kung Fu Hero is going to let uh, Britney Spears get a get a game on him, correct? Uh, get well, a round. The, the, the game the game is a given, but yeah, the round should be mm -hmm. should be gotten should be yeah. given back. Yeah. <laughs> that do plague it. mask is crazy. I love it. I really like the Plague Doctor mask. <laughs> Anybody else want a piece? You know what this Lee doesn't have? He doesn't have a mismatch with LJ42. It looks like he's he all doesn't red. Have any, doesn't have any cheese. Oh, no uh, cheese. Yeah, he's got plenty of ketchup and mustard. No cheese. Mm-hmm. Ketchup Lee. Oh, nice armor. Big boom. Oh my goodness, boop, what a mix up. Boop, I think that was a brain trap right there, just from what I've seen. Oh, the like LTGs said, are for real. Uh, All right, well, Brittany didn't need the uh, the round given, apparently. Well, he wanted that round back, but I ain't playing around. <laughs> oh, that was good. Dog. Look at the defense on Brittany. Oh, man. man. And now cool. proceed to Here watch the offense We're going on right Brittany. We're going to get chainsaws in the OP. We are not. 
is not a situation you want to be in against uh, Alyssa right now. No, oh, no, no. Right back to the wall, it looks like. Oki, yep, we got it. Oh, uh oh, uh -oh troubles. Oh, I think Fire Kung Fu might take it back. Maybe. Mm -hmm. Oh, he hit. shuts no, down the blue no stuff. blue stuff. He stuffed it. No armor on that. Not even a little bit. You can actually poke everybody out of their rage drive. Mm -hmm. Lars just wanted to do that too. And Bob. <laughs> Oh, I Bob. Love Bob, though. That's my other character that I play. Jeez. <laughs> All right, sidewalls out here, maybe saving lives. Oh, this is one of the worst stages because these there's a diet, there's a little corner at every wall. Right. So this is like the screw you over Yo! stage in terms of walls. She went right up oh, Main Street no, with that one. The Look, blue stuff again. the distance afforded her and saved her life. Oh! Oh my gosh. Fire Kung Fu Hero with the clutch blue at the last second. He's not messing around. I'm telling you, man, Lee is just hard. Lay is just hard to deal with. Oh my God. Press the button. We're going straight to the wall. You know, now I know why I lost to him last time we played. This man is an absolute monster with the ketchup yeah. bottle. I swear. All right. Well, Brittany's starting to bring it back. It's poke heavy right now. Good defense, though. But mm -hmm. not oh, interesting trade. Oh, that's, that's a trade. I guess. Mr. J was right. This is a, a, a match where, like, the trades are super important, but you don't mm -hmm. want them to be bad trades. Oh, All right. You snuck that last one okay, in. Hey, double Luigi right now. Let's see what's going on. Let's see. If this is anybody's game right now. Fire nice. Fire Hero has really, really good composure. He does not fall for the jabs. He's got good defense. Yep. And Brittany's pulling it, pulling out some really non-standard moves. Oh my god, that clash! Well, it's just really hard to play against Lay because, like, even when he's playing optimally, he's Ooh. still playing. Ooh, side grab! He's gonna be big damage. He's still playing unorthodox. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh! It's gonna get. Oh, oh Brittany hit a button. My goodness, and that's gonna end it. Yep, that's gonna be Rage Art doing the deed. Woo! All right, you Fire know, Kung Fu Hero tying it up. Nothing feels worse than losing that way because you don't expect it in high level play. Right. So near the end, if you're freaking out, if you just throw one of those bad boys out, it's it's just it's oh. I love how you don't. Do you play Tekken at all? Uh, no, not really. Okay. I just think it's funny because it shows what character you have for first on, and that is like top three, one of the hardest characters to play. Oh, is she? I would, every Julia time I, every so time I, because we've got a, we've got a guy named Fuyu in the, in the thing. Back when he was, when he was still showing up to events, I would just mm -hmm. watch him play and like, just basically he had a kind of a flow chart Julia. Mm -hmm. And I just watched this as like, I can do that. <laughs> like, <laughs> Our Julia's name is Guru. He's pretty cool. Mm -hmm. He's, uh, I mean, like, here's the thing I've noticed too, in terms of like local scenes, um, every local scene has a, has a, as a Yoshi, and I, I don't understand why you never see the character online, but offline, he's everywhere. Oh, okay. It's like a curse, I swear. <laughs> because, like, we have this dude up here in Cleveland named Bam, and I guess they call him the secret boss, because he's one of those dudes where it's just like, if you gotta get to these guys, you gotta beat this guy first, and... Gotcha. Not fun. This is final, final round, correct? Uh, yeah, this is the last game. Potentially. Yep, 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 yep. And then we'll figure out where we are in the loser's bracket, what we can run, if we can go ahead and just run winners. Um, but yeah, one of these two uh, gentlemen is going to go on to fight competitive casual after this. Well, let's see how uh, fighting Fire Kung Fu Hero does against Slooch because... I mean, we're, we're talking about a guy that can top eight <laughs> yeah. a lot of tournaments. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Oh, we are straight into revenge route. hits already. Mm -hmm. And now, is this a three out of five? Uh, no, this is only a semi, semi so now? this is, uh, yeah, best of three. Mm -hmm. Oh, good sweep. Whenever, whenever Kung, uh, Fire Kung Fu Hero has these costumes on his characters, uh, I always like to do the uh, ba da ba ba ba. Thanks, I hate it. 
Yeah, I was about to say, I left the chat earlier, right? I just didn't want your guys to hear, like, any of... My son came running out of his room saying, like, Shovel Knight, Shovel Knight! Because the <laughs> Nintendo Switch... The Nintendo the Nintendo Switch died on him. Right. Yeah, so, did you guys hear any of that? No, no, no. I don't think okay. so, anyway. Okay. Like, no, Thank I left for... Shovel Knight in, the, in peril. Oh, that game's dope. I got, like, we got, like, 200 hours on that game because that's all he wants to play. Ooh. That... They're going Quest back in Nino Boy. <laughs> Yeah, I've got the fighting, uh, the fighting game version of it, but not the, not the one player. Whoa! Right. Let's see how this goes. Yeah, okay, I'm back. Brittany's getting goofy. Hey, what up? What's up, man? How'd it go? Hey, uh, I I won two zero over Subway. Oh, you did. Subway. Well way. done. We got a cursor on the screen. <laughs> oh, do, do we? Oh yeah, we're clicking on Lee right now, it looks like. <laughs> well, for me at least, because I'm part of your stream. It's not showing up on Twitch. Oh, okay, good. Yeah, so you're good, because I got my iPad next to me too. Oh, I'm moving the wrong thing. Woo! But yeah, Mr. J, we were just talking about how I'm like, I, I made sure I left the stream earlier, because right afterwards, my son like came running out going like, Shovel Knight, Shovel Knight, Shovel Knight, because the Nintendo Switch uh, died on him when he was in his room. <laughs> uh, okay, so it looks like Britty took that one. Oh, yeah. All right, so two to one for Britty Spears means Britty goes on to fight competitive casual. After a okay. little break in well, the action. Uh, um, so, yeah. Um, let's go ahead and run. All right, so we have two. Yeah, two losers matches that we can run simultaneously. Hopefully, those get done while we're watching Casual Fight Britty. Uh -huh. um, so, Mr. J, I shall send you off to fight Ola. And, uh, yeah, we'll catch you when you get back. And uh, yeah. Fire Fire Kung Fu Hero versus Art C Nate will also be happening. But yeah, uh, thank you for letting <laughs> me be part of the stream, man. I got a, sure. I got a er, I got an early morning tomorrow. Oh, so me too. I'm gonna <laughs> hop off. Uh, I got to get ready for New Year's Eve, so that's for sure. Well, it's not tomorrow, but like the next day, I gotta right. get stuff ready for it. You know what I mean? So. We all good. Um, but yeah, man, I will see you guys at the next matchstick melee. I mean, Slooch Sounds always good, throws man. it into the Cleveland chat. So. Yeah, uh, PS4 will be in about four weeks, give or take. Sounds good. Oh, I just wish you guys did it every week, but they, they told me how you do it, how you do Street Fighter one week, and you do... Uh, uh, you know, well, Tuesdays we swap between... Um, PC, yeah. Uh, uh, Soul Calibur and Tekken. I didn't know you even Soul... I didn't know Soul Calibur had a scene. Yeah, man. That's good. Do you play any of these fighting games? Or uh, I play. Like... I play this. I play Soul Calibur. I kind of play Street Fighter, and um, I dabble a bit in GBBS. Uh, Tekken. GBBS. Tekken's just the one that I just don't have time to, to devote myself to. Oh, you can't. You have to put. It's it's the one fighting game where you cannot play other fighting games because it'll mess up your hands. Right. I don't know if you know what I'm talking about, but I played Smash Brothers for like four weeks. I took a break from Tekken. I came back. I couldn't do shit. <laughs> <laughs> Tekken. Nothing. Yeah, because Tekken, Tekken spoils people, or Smash Brothers spoils uh, players. Mm -hmm. Mind wise. What wise? Like uh, it it, it uh, spoils people uh, uh, execution wise. Mm -hmm. You know, because because like you're so used to fundamental simple stuff in Smash, then you go chop on a Tekken, then you're just like, then your mind is just isn't straight. <laughs> I don't even right. know if the stuff is simple fundamental in that game because I was because I was watching these people that were like PR players play each other and I'm just like, dude, this is definitely a fighting game. I don't know how people because as, as soon as frames are involved, you know, yeah. I'm just like, yeah, it's a fighting game. I can't. It's it's pretty cool to watch. But I was just going to locals because Smash locals just because they still had them, you know. So going over to somebody's house and whatnot. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I've actually been doing, um, been trying to get my buddies to play Smash online via Parsec. And, yeah, that'd be uh, sick. It works. We got to upgrade works. one of my buddies' computers, though. His, it's sadly behind the times. Oh, man, dude, that's why I just don't have a PC, man. It's 
which is like, I don't want to throw a tax return at a computer that I'm gonna just going to end up doing my work on. Plus, I got a three-year-old. Mm -hmm. I'm like, well, there's all the water from my cooler thingy on the ground because my son thought it was a table. Let's go. <laughs> the joys of, of parenthood. Exactly. Sluch will tell you the same thing. I don't know if he's got boys, but if he does, every, everything in that house has been broken once. Yeah, I th everyone's waiting to get to Mr. J's level where they're like, you know, basically autonomous beings. And they draw autonomous beings. Yeah. <laughs> you know, it's essentially, awesome. essentially. Is he still in the chat or is he playing somebody right now? Uh, Mr. J had to go off and play Ola. And Fire Kung Fu Hero is off to play Artsy Nate. Actually, yeah, I'm, still... I'm waiting for him to I'm waiting for his reply. Mm -hmm. I'm going to I'm going to comment on this last. I'm going to commentate on this last thing just because I like Slooch, you know, he's a great guy. <laughs> He oh, is he's a good a guy. Yeah, he's a nice, nice guy. Yeah, he, he's one of the most positive people I've ever met in my entire life. I, I, I've never, I've never, I've never uh, heard a laugh that carries across the room like that either. It's just, <laughs> it's just so like heartwarming. You're just like, what was that? It's like the father of Ohio Tekken over there. That's he, he, a little bit. Yeah, he's, uh, little he bit. certainly has some charisma. He certainly has charisma. That's for mm -hmm. certain. Oh, All dude, right, Keith. so we got, yeah, got pretty and casual. And uh, Casual has opted for Kazumi. Mm -hmm. He's playing the true Tekken waifu right now. Yep. Once main. again, raven-haired uh, waifu to the rescue. Nice. Good good uh, spot dodging. Doop. Wall break. And you know we're going to the end mm -hmm. right now. We're going to the second wall. And she can See just cover can... so much ground. Well, she actually has some of the best wall damage in the game. That's what's scary about her, is that she only has, like, 60 moves, but they're all good moves. Oh, yeah. Like, she seems pretty, like, easy to pick up and just, uh... Oh, absolutely. Uh, easy to pick up, uh, simple to pick up, uh, hard to master. Mm -hmm. um, so the, what people like to say is, like, if you want to play a Mishima, but you suck at electrics, <laughs> this is the character for you. That's funny. Because she has the same 10-frame punish. As yeah, a, our uh, as and Kazuya. our main our main tech and to here in Columbus. Uh, his name's the Keist, and uh, he he was uh, rocking Kazumi right before COVID hit. Mm -hmm. But he he had got a lot more tigers involved in his playstyle. Oh, he's just throwing a uh, tiger Hadoukens out, is what I call them. Uh, uh, yeah, there. lots of times. Mm -hmm. Tiger shots, man. Tiger shots. Ooh. Now we not see, a time to lose see, one's uh, head. Britney Spears being able to play a lot more, Ooh. you know, like he wants to play, it looks like, because he's not playing against Fight. A, a drunken style acrobat. Yep. Essentially right now. <laughs> yeah, you saw that in action. He, oh my he, god, it's... His, his Alyssa has just a built-in zone, zone out mix-up tools. Absolutely. He can just, he can just so throw you off and you just can't even do anything. Well, at the highest level of play, it's all about poking and whip punishment, and that's what we're seeing right now. I was playing somebody that played a Mishima, and he's like, I noticed you're looking for... He's on, like, Slooch's level and Britney's level. Mm -hmm. He's like, I noticed you're looking for mistakes, but we're not going to make them. You have to whip punish. Yikes. And I'm like, all right, and you have to throw out pressure. Like, I don't know if you noticed this, but when they're playing each other, they do not throw out ties for pokes or to start off their, their offense. They have to throw a down forward one out if you duck something it counts as a whiff and you can Woo! you can punish it with anything oh yeah but then but then it's like it's kind of like there's the mystery it's like is he going to use like a magic four move or like, mm -hmm. is he going to use a move that could just disrespect a simple mid poke oh yeah there's things that crush and that's why um ling shao yu is so good at, so good because aop will crush your down Ooh. forward one that is just something that i mean the only character you can't do that to with uh with um the only character you can't do that with against um, Xiao Yu is, is is Li Xiao Long, but barely anybody plays that character. And when you do run into that character, they're not bad at playing the character. And that's yeah. what's so scary about him. I don't know if uh, he's, he's actually uh, one of uh, Slooch's really good friends, Christian the, Ka the Cause. I don't know if he's ever in the matchstick melees, but like he's uh, ever in. It'd be a very, that'd be a really cool yeah. match to see. Yeah. All right, uh, fire. It looks like uh, Nate's back for you. Yeah, I, I see him. Okay. I'll, I'll try to. I'll try to get him. Oh, was that was that fire kung fu hero? Yeah, that's me. What's up, yeah. man, dude? You got to teach me this matchup. You're killing it. Oh, <laughs> man. Uh, man. Dude, I'm not that great at it, but like, you know, it's all about like 
throw out a move and keep your composure and just try to hold still and try to play more of a neutral game. So one of my favorite parts about Lee is like, you know how they'll say like some characters can carry you? Like Law can carry you if you're not that good at the game. But as soon as you start to learn DSS and proper poking, it's a it's a it's a nightmare to deal with. Um, the same with Lee. Lee can carry you a little bit, but the reward is you learning the character. You get that little bit of extra carry. It's just like you can guess what I'm gonna do, but it's not gonna work. Mm -hmm. Flip that coin every single time, and I, it's like playing Eddie. Man, it's horrible. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, let me tell you something. Speaking of DSS, I was trying out like the most optimal down four two counter combo with Law, and mm -hmm. I felt like I spent four hours. There's one particular combo where it goes like down four two, four four, up three, mm -hmm. and then four two, and then you had to do four four three four, and then you had to go for a very deep dash. And mm -hmm. the rhythm of your DS is when you do four three, back mm -hmm. four four, four four. Mm, the way, deep the way in that rhythm of that ender, it is so hard to go for a deep dash and do that, do that ender accurately. So I never got to do that against you when we played at the last matchstick melee because for some reason I have the absolute worst tournament luck. I'm like, yeah, who runs into late? And then I'm just like, there he is. How about that? <laughs> well, but, you're uh, gonna, well, you're gonna come across me often as long as you play these tournaments. Oh, dude, I will. And if you're ever at any of the offline events after all this is over, I can't wait to run into you because then we can play like no lag and have a blast. Dude, we're gonna have oh, yeah. so much fun once we're all able to play IRL again. I can't. Yeah, wait. just give me the vaccine, damn it. Get, get this, mm -hmm. uh, get yeah, no monthly kidding. Going. Mm -hmm. Just inject it into my veins. Are, are you from Ohio or Indiana? I'm from Cleveland, actually. So yeah, I'm from Ohio. Oh yeah, man. I know most people, most most players are either from Ohio or Indiana, mm -hmm. and then there's very few people that are from Louisville. Are you from Louisville? Yeah. Oh, cool. Oh, so you know Slooch. You, you know Slooch, and you know Christian Akaz, and you know all that. I, I mean, I, I mean, they're from different states, but I meet them pretty often. I mean, I, I know Manol Strife. I know Jules in person. I, 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 I'm, I've seen them like a, a several times. Well, the best part about like being in Kentucky is that you can you can rep Ohio Tech, and because you know your our airport is uh, in Kentucky. Oh, oh, oh! Airport is in Kentucky. I love it. Oh, nice. Pretty gets competitive casual off his feet, and that juggle is just enough. This is really a back and forth game, too. It's it's gonna it's gonna be it's gonna be sweet to see what Slooch can do. Yeah. It, like I said before, Kazumi's one of those characters where her her um her output okay, is, is equal to your fundamentals. So if you have good fundamentals with um with um. Kazumi, Shaheen, the Claudio, you can get a lot out of the character. <laughs> you have a small move list. Um, but hey, Matchstick. Yeah. Vehicles. Hey, uh, just letting you know, I won 2 0 over Ola. Thank you, sir. Who was he playing, Eddie? Ola? Ola was using uh, Yoshimitsu. Yoshi. Oh, who was the Eddie player he was playing then? I'll be right back. Uh, Archie Nate was the. Archie Nate's usually the Eddie player. RTA. Yeah. Round four. Fight. Right. Okay. Well, welcome back to uh, Casual versus Spears, Mr. J. It, it's a slugfest. Oh, yeah. This we is, going this right back going. into it, huh? Man, I don't even want to go to bed now. You guys are too fun to hang out with. <laughs> <laughs> That's what it's about, dude. It's about having Please. some good ass Tekken and some good ass talk about Tekken. Mm -hmm. Just chill out, watch some Tekken. You know, it's a good thing. I wish uh, Maddie could have made it to the, uh, the tournament this week. He's the devil. Oh, he's Maddie the devil gen player. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> oh, Rage Art. Nope. No punish on it either. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, that was a fantastic oh, sidestep. No. Oh. Like I said, fundamental. Karate forward punch. Let me just pet my tiger real quick. Yeah, and then have it disappear from existence. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, I love errors like that. It's just like, it's like, huh, that floor didn't load. All those boxes are sitting on nothing. <laughs> that tiger yeah, blinked out of the universe. Yeah, one of my favorite things I ever heard going to cons and playing tech in there is like whenever like the really bad, like I'm not the best at the game, but if I'm playing as casual people, I'm going to do what Slooch does to me to them. I'm just gonna go 50 and 0 on him. 
like you're cheating. I'm like, no, I'm, I'm plus framing. Actually, it's pretty cool. <laughs> just mad. And then you just turn around to him, just give him that big old smile, like that that, that genuine, like, man, this was a lot of fun, like smile. <laughs> well, when I was at Colossal Con last year, they had like the machines there, and then they had like the, the Xbox and the PlayStation setups too. And uh -huh. like, I was playing in practice mode, this kid, this like dude in a cowboy hat came up to me and he said, I'm like, hey man, you want to play some? I'm like, you want to play some games? He's like, I don't think you know who I am. I'm the guy that's been beating people in this game all day. I'm Tekken in Mortal Kombat. I'm like, that's that's great, like, man. Let's, that's let's, that's let's great. Some let's games. play and the game is, then. This, yeah. is <laughs> when I, this is when I sucked at the game too, and I just like, I like three would him like five times in a row. I'm like, been beating everybody over here, huh? And he's like, yeah. I'm like, do me a favor, go to the machine in the other room and just. Watch the monsters that are on stream. Yeah. All right. Like, uh, looks like uh, Brittany is bringing Brittany, out. Marduk. Yeah, Brittany bringing out that Marduk. He is ready. He's like, I ain't got no more time for this. <laughs> That's never a fun thing to see. Throw countering s punishment proficiency s. It's just like I can't do anything fun against this mm. person. Takes extra time to load Marduk. Yeah, all the <laughs> all those all those muscles, all those extra pixels. I'm gonna bury you. Right, we got Skeletor versus uh, Victoria's Secret model right now. So. I mean, versus Evil and basically. Yeah. Yeah, tigers for safety. There's that punishment proficiency right there. Oh, oh, oh. oh wow. Ooh, transition. Nice! Okay. Oh, the roll not helping too much. Oh, Man, I'm... nice knee. Oh, there we go, getting that full combo off. No throw break. Oh, oh man. right under the getup. Dude, that, is, that is such a good move if you got the read. It right under so the spring good. kick. Oh wow, low right in the beginning with the follow up. Oh, all right. Yo, Casual's see taking some heavy hits let's on see this if round. Spears can do this, man. Oh, good block there by Casual. Good punish right yep. after too. Starting to win these poke battles. Well, you're you're mostly gonna win poke battles against Marduk. Marduk Marduk's really like all about the, the whiff punish and just getting that ex that big damage real quick. Tiger fatality. Yeah, dude. Tiger uppercut. Yeah. No, those are tiger shot. The tiger uppercut's the one where. It... <laughs> tiger Hadouken, man. That's tiger fire. No, nah, man, because it's it's a it's a Sagat move, so it's tiger shot. Oh yeah, I know. I don't know. I never played Street Fighter. I was, I was, I was garbage at it. It can be tricky. Oh, that was a really good Although Sagat's definitely one of the oh, easier characters to play. Tall Reeve is what I call him. Ooh, this is so very close. How, uh, but Brady's got like one good hit left in him. Oh. Yeah. Oh, and Casual found his way through through the ankles. 3-0 in winner's final for Casual. So what's really funny about Kazumi's down forward one, which is the move you want to start your offense with. Mm -hmm. Remember when she was when she's like karate chopping up? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's her down forward one. Now, when somebody throws a down forward one out, you can jab, take your turn back, and get a hit on them. Here's the problem with that. Um, Kazumi has an extension after her down forward one that is punishable with a WoW Rising four. Mm -hmm. But if you press a button while she's doing that, you get a you get free damage and you get a knockdown on him too. So now okay. you're in an Oki situation against somebody with like some of the best fundamentals in the state of a WoW. <laughs> All right. So just need the just need the score on uh, Fire Kung Fu Hero versus Artsy Nate. Tag people. Dude, you know what the highlight of the stream was? Hmm. 
you get five dollars. That was fantastic. That was pretty great. I I don't <laughs> think I got to to uh, accurately express to Von Doom. Mm -hmm. uh, okay, so Nate look. Okay, looks like Nate wins two zero. But yeah, I didn't get the chance to to completely convey my expressions of gratitude to to my buddy Von Doom, who is an amazing uh, music artist, by the way. And if you're oh, not following him already, then you need to. Dude, next time, dude. Cause I got, I'm getting a new credit card in the mail, bro. I am straight up. Small. I'm gonna sub to your stream for oh, sure. Thank you, bro. Dude, I gotta. Dude, I gotta. I gotta. Appreciate it. I gotta support Ohio, man. Yeah. All right, so we're, we're going to we're going to loser semis, which means we need me C R J, and uh, artisanal Nate. <laughs> artisanal Nate, the cake. Yes. The cake Nate. It's, it's it's more like one of those like seed cakes that you leave out for birds, but still, you know, it, it's it's still artisanal. <laughs> the most artisanal. The most artisanal. Dude, um, this I is going right to be now. a first to, uh, first to two, so best of three. Okay. There's Mr. J. Dude, I'm I'm rooting for Mr. J. I really like seeing like Cooney <gasps> play at high level because I haven't seen I haven't seen it yet. No, you know? if you're a com if you're a commentator, you can't be biased. I'm not being biased. I just like the character. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, Matt, Matt being savage. Yeah. Vaughn Doom. Jewel. Losers semi. Mm -hmm. Best of three. That's my good typing. <laughs> so, do you help with the offline scene too? Uh, I'm usually just the streamer in that particular in, in that instance. Um, usually, I leave the toing to the t the actual tos because oh, yeah. our guy Keist is actually probably one of the best in terms of just uh, getting things mm -hmm. moving and keeping them moving smoothly. Uh, so I'm content to just sit in my little desk and make sure I have the names right. Uh, but it, you know, when it when you're when you're trying to keep a an FGC channel going in the midst of COVID, mm -hmm. you've kind of got to put on the TO hat as well. Oh, you gotta like, I'm just dude. Like when when all of this started happening, like I just found out like how like tight niche this community is, and like I know how people say like, oh, like like I. I you know how some people will say like the FGC can be toxic. I just haven't seen it yet, and I'm kind of happy about that. I haven't seen it either, but I've I've heard players talk about it. Uh, one of our guys uh, for GBDS, Chris Chaos, uh, mm -hmm. he's, he's going I guess through a lot of that right now. But mm -hmm. um, uh, honestly, though, I have to say like the the G like the GBDS community that that I have experienced has been very very nice. Um, yeah, and. Uh, yeah, they're always just they're always just happy to be there and to have like a tournament to show up for, which is why it's really killed me that I haven't been able to that I'm not going to be able to run one. Well, okay, the timing's weird. Um, wasn't able to run one last week, and I won't be able to run one this week because they're both the Thursdays that fall on the particular eves of the holidays. So mm -hmm. you know, no one's showing up. <laughs> oh no, I mean they could it's just like all right, it's going to be a first to five round robin. Pretty $5 much. Dollars to the victory. Well, you know, we we have. We have those. Like, you know, sometimes the population is really low, and there are other events that go on around. I know, um, and I can never remember his name. I suck. He's out of Chicago. He's a really uh, prolific streamer as well. Um, I, I think All I know is Low Kick Esports, or, or it, it's not him, but he's associated. Um, mm -hmm. But, uh, you know, they do events all the time as well, and there are other little groups that like to do. The, the team stuff so when my stuff rolls around at nine people are usually worn out or mm -hmm. or they're just like hey matt will be there next week yeah whatever but when they turn out bro they turn the f out I'm and talking that's like good. 60 60 viewership like for just a random thursday night stream with no prize pool you know i mean where do you get where do you guys because you're in columbus right yeah where do you guys hold your offline events down there? Is that do you like have a place you go to? Or uh, we you, did. Like... Um, we were doing Street Fighter nights. We're at a uh, like a mom and pop uh, bar. Well, because it's all mom and pop bars out here. Um, mm -hmm. But uh, that place had to shut down for multiple reasons. 
Oh, and no. so we're we're kicked out of there. Although they have moved and they have said that when COVID's over, we can probably start start it back up again. But we'll have to see. <laughs> and then, got an OSHA violation. Why are all these TVs in here? Yeah, we pretty much. Work. And then um, we were also doing our big multi-game nights. It was kind of like Smash plus all the FGC stuff in the basement of a Donato's on the OSU campus. Yeah, I heard. I saw that on stream. I think. Uh, I, I think Johnny used to go to that quite a bit. Yeah. I, I believe it was a month. Every so often, he would come down. But yeah, that was every Tuesday. Was that on? I think it's Front Street, right? Uh, was High Street, actually. High Street. Yeah. Yeah. Every city's got the one. Well, the one thing. That's good. But um, yeah. I. Uh, so basically, what happened to me, what man was like, I worked in fine dining for like seven years, and then I finally got to quit. And I'm like, dude, I could finally go to offline like Tekken and Super Smash Brothers events, and then COVID mm -hmm. happened a week later. <laughs> yeah. And I All couldn't right, we'll do, do anything. The, sorry, real, real quick, I've got to be, I've got to be to right here. Um, Artsy Nate, if you are listening, uh, we really need you in here for your loser semi match. Uh, I'm gonna set like a two minute timer at this point, and if you can't make it, man, I'm gonna have to DQ. I really don't want to, but we got to keep things moving. It's getting late for everybody. Is he a Columbus player as well? Okay, he says he's here. All right, time to bring it in then, bud. Bring, bring it into, bring it into the, into the, into the match. Need a fresh one. There you go. Okay, there we go. Uh, actually, I'm not sure we've ever met uh, Artsy Nate in real life. That's the thing, though, too. Like, if you... Is there, like, a cap for the amount of people you want in tournament? Oh, there, well, I mean... You don't want to go over? That depends on the game. Because, uh, uh, like, for, for Tekken, I almost want to make it, like, 12. Just okay. because the online interface is so horrible that half mm -hmm. the time is just eating up getting the match together um, but uh, for like Street Fighter typically it, it's easiest if we keep it under uh, keep it at or under 24 mm -hmm. um, GBVS goes by in a heartbeat so we can load that the heck up like their online experience is so clean and nice because the reason I'm, I'm asking is because I, I have some friends that I play with like all the time online. They're all mm -hmm. hardwired, you know, and, and, and they would they would love to come to something. Invite like them on by. I will. I got a few tournament players that like to play, so and, yeah. and they just haven't had an event to go to. Yeah, I know uh, Fight Sessions uh, sends us some of their guys every so often. That's good. And then I think there's like Button Mash is another one that happens on Tuesdays too. But like, Button. you know, I got I got to keep it I got to keep it with Ohio. So Right, <laughs> right. The Midwest. And this is this is a match I've been wanting to see all night because cuz RC Nate this man this man messed me up. <laughs> <laughs> I got destroyed. I got a flat top beat down from Paul. It was horrible. <laughs> yeah, well, he'll definitely be seeing what he can do about that with Mr. J, but Mm -hmm. Kunimitsu's been on top of things. You got the Bayonetta costume on almost. Yeah, well, no, it's like this is straight up like Dark Magician. Mm -hmm. Like, yeah, I summon my blue eyes white Paul and it's like, yeah, well, counter with the uh, summon Dark dark Kunimitsu Magician. So you see that shoulder that uh, Paul just threw out? Yeah, yeah. Okay, so that move has crushing properties and evasiveness. So you're like, oh, I'll check with the jab, and he'll throw the shoulder out, he'll duck the jab, he'll get free damage on you. And at the wall, that you get a death fist after that, too. So like I said, Paul is a uh, is a damage machine. Oh, yeah, absolutely. the other absolutely. thing that's crazy is like, you can tell how good RC Nate is oh. as a player in terms of execution, because he's getting actual Korean backdashes off, which is extremely difficult to do with Paul, because he has a back sweat. So you can't you can't you can't cheat the uh the Korean back there. Oh. So if you can space people out with Paul, he's one of the absolute hardest people to deal with. Too. 
and you're just dealing with stuff that has crushing prophecies properties like in, in the old games paul used to be a high risk high reward character and with some of the new moves that they gave him they have just taken so much risk away from the character to the point where you need to get the life lead and you might have to time him out sometimes but he's so scary because if he throws one dumb thing out half the life bar is gone. right so that's what we're dealing with right here Ooh. so like mr j's wow like said, he straight up shut down the kunimitsu's uh, rage drive Yep, so basically boop, what we're dealing boop, with right now is boop, we really boop, want boop. this baby to kill right here because wow. he didn't, you know, now we're stuck in a 50-50 situation. Yep. <laughs> or Paul can kill him even from the ground. Round a piece now. Mm -hmm. So he started off with something a little risky there, but he got some trade-off for it. Mm -hmm. uh, Mr. J loves those uh, those high-risk, high-rewards. Well, that's that's a, that's what you want to be doing against uh, Paul sometimes. Like, you got to be super safe against oh, Paul. Oh, no, him, bro! Then, yeah, yeah, like I said, the Death Fist is ridiculous in this game. So you, you could have Death Fist in a Death Fist, but I don't think you wanted to risk it. Yeah. So he just threw Demo Man out instead. Oop. Oh, he could have side. That's a good move to sidestep. Yeah. I would like to get Comatose into one of these one night, but I don't know. He seems pretty uh, adamant works, to not play. He, he, he works nights. Oh, and okay. I, uh, yeah, so I don't think he'll ever be able to make it to something like this. But if he does, I mean, we can always get like Maddie in and stuff like that. Oh, sure. People. Oh, wow. Oh. All right. Mr. J kind of getting taken apart in that first game. Artsy Nate. Mm -hmm. Game one. Like I said, you can only make two mistakes against Paul. Yep. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Starting the fight and continuing the fight. <laughs> yep. <laughs> But yeah, I do need to advertise these a little better. It's 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 a little rougher now that I'm back at work. Mm -hmm. <sighs> I just need to start dragging my laptop around or work, something. Though? Hmm. Feel good to be back at work though. Kinda. If it, mm -hmm. like, I get it. we're we're getting a lot of growing pains because the company's new. So. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah. My my friend is my, yeah my coworker uh, is also like a buddy a long time buddy of mine and he's. He's losing it because he's ever only ever worked with like established, uh, you know, building, uh, yeah, established businesses. So mm -hmm. like pretty much all the hard work's been taken care of. You just got to go through the motions, and yep. we're in there basically figuring out the trajectory of this company for like the next like year or two. And he's and like you know things aren't solved, and he's losing it. And he's like, why do they want us to figure out how to work on this conveyor belt? And they're like because they've never done it before. We've all never done it before. <laughs> so that's the thing though, like I'm, one of my favorite things that I ever learned from like reading business books and stuff is like mm -hmm. whatever job you think you're doing, you're actually in sales. Um, and what it basically means is like you are the, the driving factor of the company. So you got to sell the stuff. To, yeah, to well, I know, we'll, I, know to... I know we'll be the complaints department because we're the only folks in that, in that building that speak uh, uh, English as a first language. Uh, nothing wrong with that. <laughs> <laughs> It's well, it gets a little rougher because our our in between uh, speaks Russian as a first language and mm -hmm. English as a third, and zero Taiwanese. <laughs> zero Taiwanese. Do you speak a Taiwanese? Heck as no. Well, <laughs> I'm from Ohio. <laughs> <laughs> We're just the dude. Just have time to pick it up. <laughs> it might be. It might be. Yeah, no, we do have a translator, but she only visits like two or three times a week. Sounds great. <laughs> it sounds. It's fantastic. <laughs> All yeah. right. Okay, oh, so we've got the Master like, Raven. Okay, it looks like Mr. J does not yeah. want to deal with Paul, so he is just going to be like, you ain't whiff punishing me because I'm going to disappear. Yeah, I'm pretty much. I'm going to turn into a log Naruto style. You, pr you yeah, brought yeah. out the main. Congratulations. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so a lot of people don't know this, but like uh, Master Raven actually has some of the best damage in the game wow. and some of the most insane wall carry as well. So let's see like what he can do with her. Yeah, it's, I, I, I mean... I think that's a recent buff to the to the damage, right? Like, like, I don't even think there was a buff to the damage because most people would say there was a nerf to the damage because season four uh, added five more damage or five more life to the health bar, and you're hmm. like, oh well, that doesn't matter that much, and it it does. And they they scale damage down in combo. It's, it's an absolute disaster. So like I said, everybody had like I can do 90 damage in season three, and right. now it's like okay, I'm doing 70. And now I got to do a lot more. I got to rely more on fundamentals. So it's like all the people that thought they were good in season three, they're just their garbage. And <laughs> oh, no demo man today. Mm -hmm. No, thank you. Ooh, like, demo man is actually out. really good to parry too. So 
the one thing I wish I had was a good rage drive. Yeah. Law has the worst rage drive in the game. <laughs> yeah, well, what I'm waiting for is to see what, what Mr. J's men actual mentality is. Because when he's having fun, he's going to go for that unblockable that comes from, like, the goddamn stratosphere. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> and if he doesn't, then it's all work. <laughs> I think the one thing he's trying to do right now is like, you see that 14 in the bottom right of your screen? That's gone, son. Like, it's gone. <laughs> it's going yeah. away. Like I said, you can't call, count fall out. He's no slouch. No, I mean, I mean look at that damage off one mistake. crazy yeah. strong. Yeah, he didn't finish demo because he wanted the Oki afterwards, mm -hmm. too. There's Ooh. the sweep. A good throw break, though. Mm -hmm. He's got a good throw break, so yeah. it's like, like I said, fundamentals, mm -hmm. man. Nate is getting steadily he's... better. Oh, no. that's good. Well, I mean... That was a quick comeback, though. Mr. J tying it up 1-1. Well, one, this... one. So, Master Raven is another one of those characters. So, in terms of, like, the people... The, the characters that you never expect to run into are the ones you run into in offline environments. So, like, I I never run into Julia online. Mm -hmm. I run, the characters I always run into in offline tournaments are... <sighs> the Bears. Lucky Chloe. <laughs> Eliza. For sure, okay. for sure, Chloe, yeah. Master Raven and then and Leo. Now I'm fortunate enough to have a friend that plays Leo exclusively, so it's one of those matchups that I'm kind of comfortable with. Right. But he doesn't like to play like an absolute like, you know, piece of garbage. So like I I'm never ready for Hell Sweep from Leo. It sucks because her Hell Sweep is er I don't I don't even know you get to stay there, uh, if, 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 yeah, if we don't know. Because I don't know. <laughs> you know? Well, this is my first Tekken. Oh, I mean, I actually, I played Tekken 6 enough mm -hmm. that I could beat the uh, the weird extra story mode where you had to fight um, mm -hmm. Devil Jin on that train. And I took him down with Lili because Lili had, like, just, like, mash R2 to win. <laughs> mm -hmm. I don't know, man. I, 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 here's the thing. Like, you know, I'm pretty, I'm pretty, uh, I'm pretty out there. I've, I've never misgendered a person. I, I don't want to start by misgendering a uh, video game uh, character. You know, right? Yeah. Gotcha. What up, Fire Kung Fu Hero? What's up, Fire man? Kung Fu Hero? I got blown up by RT Nate's Paul. Uh, uh, to go take you and me break. both, dude. <laughs> yeah, I, but... I just hear him say in the chat. Oh, here he I, is. I, yeah, <laughs> I think it's it's a demon it's, himself. It's a. Uh, I think it's a regrettable choice for Nate, honestly, because he always seems to not want to play Paul, but he's so good with him. Well, that's Wait a minute, like, people... just, was he originally a fusion? Well, remember there was the rank reset. Well, yeah, but oh, because like I originally saw him as fusion, and that now he's like back to Eternal Ruler or something. He's like he just, yeah. he just went on rank real quick and just ranked up and just popped on the back on the tournament or something. <laughs> Dude, honestly, I wish I if I didn't know about the rank reset or I would have grinded rank a lot more. I feel like I'm not playing like law like I want to play against you guys because I'm talking to all my friends, they're like, oh you could have easily got to like Fujin or Ryogen with your law. I'm yeah. like, really? Thank oh you so much. sorry, nice use of armor there. Oh that was a really good armor move. Jay is staying on this defense. Yeah, he's really he's he's really got the Nintendo boss battles down pat. Mm -hmm. He got the Nintendo finger. That's what I call it. <laughs> yeah. It's oh, like, it's good the, clash. It's those, uh... oh, oh, all those Nick's plus up. frames working to Nate's advantage. He got super lucky right there. Oh man, oh, dude, what a punish. that's so fast. That was so. Is that punishable? Punish with the rage art. Oh yeah, that's super punishable. Is it like? Is it like? Uh, it, it's like a spark palm thing. It like. Jab punish? I'm surprised he didn't get the float combo right there. Oh, there we Master go. We got a juggle. We can't quite get him off the off the landing. Mm -hmm. oh, we break the there it is. Uh, keep it on ties right, down the next one. Here we go. <laughs> yes. This is what I was talking about, man. Her damage is oh! slow. Yeah, he's having fun. He's having fun. Right. <laughs> nice backdash oh, through the sweep. God. Man, what? he jumped over those lows. I'm Dude, telling that you. was a weird hit property. I thought he... I thought she would have got hit right there. We got the red. You know, oh, you know, we got Paul's the red dress on. Oh, you know, doesn't oh, even man. get to burn the blue stuff. Man, Mr. J. Uh, he he has those like uh, Nintendo boss battles on acid. He, yeah. he played every Nintendo game mm -hmm. where he had like no lives, no health meter. He, he played it as if he had no life or health left. 
All yeah, dude. Right, basically, what happened right there? They were playing the Mario Party game where they're climbing up the pole, and, and <laughs> Ar Archie Nate got hit by every blooper on the way yeah. up. And uh, now I believe, yeah, we have a run back because uh, it's Britney Spears versus Hyper Jewel, and uh, Britney's the one that knocked uh, Mr. J into losers in the first place. That's how this goes, honestly. I think. I think he's gonna. I think he's gonna pull out Master Raven. And oh yeah. So the thing about Leo is St Leo like stay is on Master Raven for um for people that really really love Tekken because this this is it's a it, the character just is is good at everything. Right. You know. And you're and you're uh, you're talking about somebody who is on par with Lee for the best wall carry in the game. So there's characters that the characters you that are really good are characters that can carry from wall to wall. Okay. So yeah. Lars can carry from wall to wall. Leo can carry from wall to wall. Uh, Lee can carry from wall to wall. But like Lee and Leo can carry from corner to corner if mm -hmm. they really wanted to. Like that's how good their wall carry is. Nina has really good wall carry too, but it's really hard to execute. I think Geese Geese uh, Geese has insane wall carry. Well, Geese is Geese is kind of an exception because Geese gets more damage out of a parry than he does a low block, which is kind of really weird because usually parries are for the moves that are like you're only you're only parrying something on a read. It's so like when whenever you see somebody just like parry something, it's because they know it's coming. And there's some people that get an accidental parry, and those are my favorite. And you'll know it's an accident because they won't get the combo. <laughs> oh yeah, it, it, usually your average low parry damage is it, it's like about an uh, average of fifty damage. It's fifty to sixty but, damage. But but yeah, but like you're saying in Geese's case, he can get a lot more than sixty or something out of a low parry. So that's the thing though. Like when I'm playing online, like I'll play against a lot of people that will play on save because I'll like go on ranked, and it's just like okay, well they're gonna do a get up kick. Okay, well that's fourteen frames. Well I, with law. You can do three, four, and then three, four into DSS three. Get like sixty damage at the wall. So if they mess up, you can kill them <laughs> essentially. Mm -hmm. And can you and uh, Kung Fu Hero? Can you do the same thing with Lei? Like if they if they mess up a get up kick, it's just it's, it's GGs at that point. Uh, I mean, it, it just it depends. Like you can, uh, well, it depends on what face position they're in. So like if you're face down, feet away. You mm -hmm. can more likely can catch your opponent doing it because usually what it is is when you're face down, feet away, the wake up kicks come off the slowest in that in all in all face positions. Mm -hmm. Face down, feet away has the slowest wake up kicks ever. So basically, if they try to press buttons, uh, if they try to attempt a wake up kick, there we go. In that okay, position, uh, yeah, it their body. So basically, the least they can do is just recover. All they can do is like back roll, block, or side roll. Or, you know, all I could do is tech roll or get up. And, mm -hmm. so, and you so, said you play law as well, right? Or your brother uh, law? Well, uh, my brother plays law. I was I was in I was playing as law in practice mode because I was trying those combos. But I don't I normally don't use laws in actual matches. But I I play against my law. Uh, I play against my brother. He uses law, and his law is just devastating. Like he just he, law is just known to just shut you down a lot. Okay. Uh, real, real, real quick, no guys, are, are you guys are you guys well. both cool to, to keep commentating through this one? I gotta kind of do a thing on the phone real fast. Yeah, I can okay, do that. yeah, yeah. We're just I'm having a conversation. Just, I appreciate you. it. <laughs> yeah, so like, I like here's the thing about DSS. I barely, I I think I have a ninety percent like success rate with DSS, and I, that's really high because even some of the best players drop that shit like all day, you know? Yeah. So, I mean, there's a reason why they're trying to get them to uh, the wall in a different type of carry, and I get it. But yeah, the um, the thing uh, the thing about walls like like bread and butter is like it's just the sample combo with another back two, and yeah. then instead of DSS three, it's DSS four, four or four. So I can, I mean, it's you get seventy two damage off it, which is pretty good. But the problem is if you don't if you don't get that DSS dragon kick at the end. You get sixty damage. Now, oh yeah, it's, yeah, you, it's devastating. Mm. Now, if you get them to the wall at just the right angle, you can get an, you can get another DSS dragon cannon off on them, or you can just do a junkyard low if you're not going to reach it in time. So oh he's yeah, just yeah. so versatile. I love it. Oh yeah, you know, uh, yeah, he's got some interesting. He's got some interesting combos that revolve junkyard kick. Where if you do junkyard kick right off the bat, 
and then do DSS three, and then you can dash in and do another junkyard kick and go into DSS four. That's like nets you do like ninety three points of damage. Well, in rage and counter hit, it's one hundred and five. Oh yeah, uh, definitely. And if you get them to the wall, it's one hundred nineteen. But yeah. Oh, I've yeah, done I mean, it but... once because everybody always pairs the second. Yeah. Uh, now let's see what we got here, man. Oh man, Hyper Jewel and Brit Britney Spears, they're going at so, it now. Like I was saying before, Marduk's one of those characters where you get to make two mistakes against them. Yeah, he's he's oh, got I, some good man. Not Jules had some. He didn't really read that low. He, I think he just knows that he was just going to go for the low because basically, you're you're up against the corner of the wall. I, I think Jules is one of those players that I think he plays by feel just just by watching him because there's no flow chart for Master Raven. Now, in terms of Marduk, if <laughs> if you get whiff punished once and you're at the wall, man. It is just a 50-50 hell tornado, and that is just not a place you want to be with a kid. Oh, man. Yeah, oh, yeah. Well, yeah. Well, Arnold, he's known to whiff punish. He's got good range. He can just carry you through the entire wall. And the crazy thing is, you know, he can he can reset a combo. He can just grab you from the ground, pick yeah. you, you up, and then he can just keep you on the combo. Well, every, every, every ground grab is a 1 plus 2 break. I just don't know if the window the timing window is is um well there's two ways you could break a one plus two throws if you're talking about his uh veil tudo stance yeah he, where, where he's on the ground mm -hmm. and you could you could either not press anything or press one plus two at the same time to break it you can mm -hmm. not press anything but the only catch is you normally a marta player would either go for a, uh he would either go for the other three other parts of the three-way throw mix up well one of my favorite parts about marduk is like I wouldn't say he's high risk, high reward because he's just he's just really good. You know, he's he's just an all around good character. The only weakness the character has, yep, there we go. Yeah, you see, he's got to be ready for that that thing right there because that's just yeah, and he got the game because of it. Now, yeah, your best bet is to either anticipate him doing that. I think you, mm -hmm. I think it's like a, I think it's like what is it like a, yeah, you would have to low parry that. Well, here, you know what the best part about that uh, that that uh, that little uh, ankle grab is too. If you block it, you get a rising two, no matter what character. It's it's not one of those moves where you have to float it with a rising four. Thank God, because that would be way too strong if you don't get like a full punish off on that. You know what I mean? Because he gets, I think 55, 50 damage out of that. I mean, you saw it <laughs> for yourself. Oh, you talking about Marduk's wall rising too? Not even the wall rise too. Like, like I said, Marduk's like one of like four characters in the entire game that can attack you on the stomach, like head facing towards you, which is really scary because your muscle memory isn't used to that. It's like, oh, I get free Oki right now. Not with Marduk, man. If you mess up, GGs. It's just he's he's one of those characters. Like, I have a friend that plays Marduk, like he, like a very high level Marduk. So I'm used to that stuff. Like when I was at my local a few weeks ago, I was playing some casuals with, with one of the Indiana players and uh, he was playing Marta and I actually got the game because he did that little ankle grab and I blocked and punished it. And it's one of those things where it's like, am I going to do it? I don't know. But uh, yeah, man, it's Marta's scary and he's scarier in rage. And yeah. his, his rage drive, his rage drives gross. His, yeah, and he destroys people on the ground. He just, oh. you have to basically get away with him. You have to do like the most safest, like wake up kicks, or you just have to like tech roll. But like, you just, it's like there's little you can do on the ground. He he destroys people on the ground. He's a tried and true MMA fighter in this game. And that is just the coolest thing. Because, you know, he's based off of Goldberg, actually. Oh, <laughs> yeah. I mean, mm -hmm. he, he, that hints the beard. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> All right, well, we got uh, Mr. Jake going off with a really good. You know, I, I, right I like now. how he, I like how they modeled his character compared to his other uh, older counterparts. Like, what they I made think it... this is the best he's ever looked. I... Yeah, his legs. <gasps> oh yeah, he, he oh, got wow. trigger happy at that point. Mm -hmm. I mean, like the fact that they're using purple and green, which are contrasting colors, like it just, it just, it fits so well. Well, I'm talking about his, like, the way they modeled his legs. They look more realistic compared to his other counterparts. Like, his other ones were, like, he, his legs look a lot stubbier. And his shoes and his legs looks kind of just stubby. It looked, like, ill-proportioned. Well, he looks like an athlete now. Like, that's the best part. Like, he, he's, like, legit. Yeah, but they made his legs look more realistic. Mm-hmm. 
I, I call those the Cleveland Cavs. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, there you go. There's Jules with a crazy wall carry. That's just what. And, and Hyper, what you, know, you know, Raven, Raven, Raven she, I mean, he, she is kind of similar to like Alyssa. She does all these moves that basically, she does all these crushing mid pokes and like oh, moves that telling people, people out right off the bat. It's like no games. But yeah, you're right. He's, he's just he's, like, yeah. oh no, oh, man. is he gonna break it? Oh dang! Here we go. Okay, so what I noticed um, with um, Britney Spears as Marduk is that if he is not confident in the um, throwing the punches out out of tackle, he'll throw one plus two out. That is the one that people do not break very often. Now, what we're right. gonna figure out now is is Mr. J gonna get it? Because I think I think he oh, more likely yeah. would. Oh no. Okay. Like I said, dude, look at her damage. She has like deep I think she has some of the best damage in the game. Like a lot of characters have really good damage calls. I mean I mean that's like that's that you could say that with all characters. I remember it's ever since Tekken Tag 2, they started uh they really buffed like all most characters uh juggle combo damage. Like mm -hmm. Fang used to had poor used to have like a poor juggle damage. And Lay was kind of okay, but he wasn't like, you know, he's, he wasn't really meant to have crazy damage. But like, our, but ever since Tekken Tag 2, they buffed everyone's like damage, even Fangs. Like, even, even a majority of characters that had like piss poor mm -hmm. like damage combo output. But yeah, like. Oh, the one thing I wanted to tell you about DSS, like the secret to DSS, do you know, you want to know what it is? What? You don't have to do it fast. It's, yeah, it's, it's not it's, as it's, fast as people think it is. Yeah, so. it's it's a rhythm based thing. Basically, it's kind of like you treat it as like three steps. It's like it's like four threes, one step, and then left right is like or back forward is a uh, is another step, and then forward four is like the third step. So it's kind of like a rhythm based thing. So you treat it like as three groups of like it's like a rhythm thing. You treat it like they were like their own individual buttons. Does that kind of make sense? Yeah, so like DSS is back forward forward and DFS is just back forward. So people, a lot of people don't know that he has two transitions. Oh yeah, so, yeah, it's a slow so, version, and the other one is like mm -hmm. the back forward forward where you do the the DSS. Oh yes. Yeah. So when you do DSS, when you're running and you're hitting four three, as soon as your is your thumb or if you hit if you play claw your index finger hits yeah. three, then you are just putting in back forward 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 four and you can do it in that motion in that rhythm too it doesn't even have to be that fast oh yeah i try to get i try to really i, I just just come to find out about it when i was just kept toying with it in practice mode like i just realized like man i'm going faster than i need to so i'll try to train my mind to go slower with it well the thing is like you your brother plays uh law and like you're playing him and you, and you play arguably one of the hardest characters in the game to play and then you're trying to do dss and you're just like you've been doing this bullshit the entire time we've been playing together but that's also very nice that you have a that you have an offline partner you know oh yeah definitely yeah i can play him against my brother straight up and yeah is he a super high rank with his law Dude, he uh, he got as high as uh, Fusion before yeah. before the re rank reset. That's so about. I take, it, I think he's he's now. I think he's like at least you're just at Mighty Ruler. Mm -hmm. I, I think so. If it's legit, I I wasn't able to on go on. But man, yeah. Hyper In Jewel, he, he's mm -hmm. he's really playing it really solid over here. Yeah, in season three, I think I could have got to like divine oh, I got, yeah. or Fusion. Yeah, I just yeah, could. I didn't have the time. <laughs> Like, like when I was playing oh. you, like when we played last time, like you're the first person I ever played in match wow. that way, and you played me, I'm like, do I just, do I just suck at this game? I'm like, no, I just don't know how to play against Lay, and then I don't know how to play against like. Oh uh, yeah. Oh, did Moody. I play to you like like was yeah. it like two weeks or four or four weeks ago? You were I, I, you used the I law was, at least once. I was the law that played you, and I just got completely smoked out by Lay. I'm like, I don't know what's happening right now. And then Slooch on stream said he's like. Donnie was doing everything right uh, in his term. Uh, I just don't uh, think he knows how to play. Talking this guy. Character. Have I met him in person? Probably not. I don't know. Yeah, my brother was asking who, who I was talking to, but you probably don't know you. But 
I'm glad. I'm, I, I like to see a fellow law player. But yeah, when we play more offline, man, like when tell, we play more Tell him to follow us on Twitch. <laughs> Yeah, but uh, I, I, well, he goes by Night Rainer, so you might need to invite him into the uh, night. Invite him into the Discord server. We'll get to that. Sounds good. Have him hit the <laughs> follow button. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, you, well, we're not. Well, you're not. Well, you don't have this. Uh, you don't have this on stream via Twitch. I don't think. Do you? Yeah, I'm. Str um, I'm yeah, I'm streaming this on Twitch right now. Oh, I don't. I don't. And I, I didn't get the link. Uh, it's it's right there in the challenge. Yeah, so you can just um, so like I'm just uh on here right now because he he sent me like an invite and then I can watch the stream like on my computer and like commentate like through it so I don't have any like back. Yeah, no, I always I always put the stream link in the in the in the uh, the challenge description, which is sick. I want people to watch. Is, yeah, is, I talk, I, yeah, what's, I talk. what's better to use? Would you is challenge or smash GG better to use? Because I know like, they're both if you're just doing one thing, challenge is way better. If you're doing okay. like a, a multi event, like 145 person event, then that's that's a job for smash GG. Well, dude, when we were at when we went when we were at Raj last year, man, mm -hmm. they tried to run an 80 man Tekken tournament on challenge. It yeah, took, yeah, it was they rough. they were not aware that the well, plus Smash GG has a habit of like. Well, it isn't like just, the bracket and challenge site. Is it just like lags out because it's more than 80 people or something? Well, well the it problem does. with challenge is that it doesn't have a database behind it, so it will not see people like Smash GG will. Like when yeah. they did a challenge bracket, they had to redo the brackets 10 times because in the A bracket, um, Chris, Teo, Johnny, and Sloop were all in the same bracket. They're like, you can't have that because then none of us will be in Grand Finals. The grand Finals will make sense. Because you're trying, at the end of the day, you're trying to make it fair for everybody, too. Right. And the people that play with each other all the time don't want to play with each other first in the tournament. Exactly. That's what happened. Yeah. And then I found out on Twitter that the dude that runs Raj is just like, I'm done. I'm not doing this anymore. So Ohio lost its major, too. Yeah. yeah so that was not a great time. No. But I had a blast when I was there, though. Same. Oh, you were there? I was streaming it. Hell yeah, man. That's awesome. That was kind of my, uh, that was kind of my, like, on my application for, uh, man. Frosty Faustings. Well, that I was see that mouse though. pointer looks great. It looks great on your stream. Dude, when what I am? was, uh... When I was um when I was at Raj though, I was absolutely obliterated <laughs> like the entire time. So I I'm just drunk. Playing upside down Japanese guitar hero. Oh shoot. <laughs> Man, I'm telling you, there's like these some of these characters, they they have these crazy obscure, like evasive crushing hitboxes that are basically good, are good counters for anything that's cheap. Some people have a weird oh, counter cheap. Mm. Have you seen Paul in this game? Oh man! And Paul, you know what, Paul? I was gonna say earlier. Oh, he didn't you didn't know, get out Paul of that. Paul is kind of like Paul is like the American Fang way. Oh it, my I mean, God! He he has he has crushing and evasive properties he should not have. In this. It's, it's it's obnoxious. Oh yeah, I did some type of move, and he did like some evasive side mid mid crush move. So Ooh, one of the worst like parts that. about Paul in this game is that oh, his down forward, wow. his down forward two has pushback on it, so you can literally down forward two into down forward two if they try to rush you, and you just get eighty damage. It's it's nonsense. I know this is exciting. It's but just like I I feel so bad for for Sloosh just sitting there in grand finals, just like somebody lose. <laughs> What, what, how many how many matches did he play to get to Jerry? Was it like six so far? Uh, mm -hmm. How many has Sloosh played? No, I mean, how many did Britney Spears and Hyper Oh, did, has so have Bri uh, there? This will be game five, so this will be the last one. Jeez. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's supposed to be like a first to three thing? Uh, first, what a run Yeah, back. first to three, yeah. What a, what a run back, man. For finals. Man, this is some like uh, crazy uh, Dragon Ball Z moment here. Mm hmm. Little one of my bit. favorite jokes is. How many sayings does it take to screw in a light bulb? It's like one, but it takes three episodes. <laughs> yeah, I think Matt oh, Pat oh, told oh. that joke on one of the latest uh, film theories. Were you guys talking about all the memes with the twisted T earlier too? Yes. Oh my god, dude! There's been so many. Like very good one. Yeah. Pretty much everyone's got the uh, the the um. 
I always keep that thing on me. <laughs> my my favorite one so far is like you know in GTA Five how like you go into your like weapon inventory and the melee weapon is a twisted T can. <laughs> oh that oh this is great. Sluice just uh, got in the in the in the the Twitch chat and he says I'm not complaining. I'm getting some good R and R while watching this tech. <laughs> <laughs> he didn't put good ass second because he's a family man. Exactly. Like, <laughs> but yeah, he's probably got like his feet up and like a like a cup ramen in his hand. And just, oh, like, bro, the don't, don't get me pillow. started, dude. I'm about to make a cup ramen, dude. I just went to I just went to the 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 I went to Chinatown the other day in Cleveland and uh, I spent 150 dollars on snacks I can't read and nice. uh, we're like 10 for 10. On we delicious. we don't have a Chinatown in Columbus. We have Japanese uh, we have Japanese town mini mini like Japanese little, town. Like well, here's the thing though. Like um, in Cleveland, we have like we have a really big like um, like uh, Japanese, uh, Korean, and uh, Chinese like population. You know, mm -hmm. like up here. So Chinatown isn't really Chinatown as it as much as it is like you know all of a, all of a town. You gotcha. Know? Oh like, no, you're gonna get, you're gonna get everything you need and. I will never go to Giant Eagle or Kroger again for uh, for rice for uh, rice wine vinegar or like all that good stuff. Right. Because I can get a giant like bottle. Oh. For like. Oh $4. wow, <laughs> that headbutt came out of nowhere, dude. That was a this really juggle, good one. I, I'm surprised he risked it. Mm. He's gonna get the round because of it. Yeah. But um, no, we have we have a dedicated like Japanese market pavilion. Uh. Now, granted, they sell other things. Oh, of course. But yeah, um, yeah it's it is Japanese owned and operated, and so is the bakery down the street and the full-on Japanese restaurant. And Mr. J is just making headway here, and it's amazing. I love I love going there. If I had like real money, I'd be eating their like sushi every day. Dude, this is just this is not a way you want to end a run back. No, either. like getting three O like uh -oh. that is just horrible. Okay, so it looks like Marduk lost the wall right there, but he really wanted that damage. So yeah, like now yeah. it's just a spacing battle because yeah, most man, both man. of them are really scared to Ooh, approach oh, each other. Man. And, oh man. You know what? That was a good check on the uh, on the phase. Mm-hmm. Oh. Ooh, that was real. Nice quick rise though from uh, from mm -hmm. Spears. So here's the thing though, like because of the position they're in right now, if Master Raven gets Oh the, launch, the counter Oh no, that whiff punish. If oh, Mr. Raven gets man. a launch, if Master oh, Raven that's gets wrong. a launch, yep, that's it. He's going to be able to kill him with that damage. Oh, too. my Raven. gosh. Wait, I, I thought he was going to fall with, like, a rage, oh yeah, rage attack. Oh, my God. Oh, man. Was that just two standing, like, threes or yep. what? Like I said, Master Raven has some of the best damage in the game. Like, you know what I'm talking about? So, Golly, brother. Woo. All right, well. Looks like, uh, yeah, looks like competitive casual is going to have to put his, uh, his, his chopsticks down. His cup ramen down, His cup dude. ramen, yeah. We don't even know what kind of China or China or little Tokyo it, you have downtown it, it, in Cincinnati either. We don't even know where you got that from. Yeah. Uh, I, wait, no, I, did, didn't he move? I thought he moved closer to us now. I don't know. I can't remember. I, 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 I'm lucky I remember people's names most of the time. Uh, but yeah, so two, three on bridge. What if he fell asleep during his rest and relaxation at Mr. Gage? You know what? <laughs> Fair Jay. play to him, because he'll probably still wake up and, like, put up a decent fight. <laughs> but let's wipe, get him in here. Boogers out of his eyes. It's like, oh, uh, uh. <laughs> It's like, where, where am I? Uh, okay, lucky Chloe, let's go. <laughs> Dude, I just finally land the, the most I'm optimal awake. down forward to the <laughs> <I'm awake. laughs> I knew you were awake, Sloosh. These guys aren't watching the Twitch, so they don't—they don't know the—they they aren't seeing it. Um, but yeah, let's uh, let's do this. Dude, I'm surprised how much uh, battery Twitch drains. I went from seventy percent to ten percent in two hours on my iPad. Yep. Ah, uh, yeah. You might as well leave. You might as well leave that leave that you charge on in, your. Yeah. Uh, I'm doing that now for sure. I wonder if that kills your battery. I wonder if that kills your battery if it's any smartphone device or a tap or a portable device. Like if you just leave it charged, and you just keep, or while you leave it charging, you you keep uh, uh, playing YouTube or Twitch or whatever. You keep no, they're most modern devices are pretty well power regulated to be able to function while charging without 
causing damage to the battery or anything. That's good. Especially because well, I had camera. a Samsung Galaxy S5, and I only had it for nearly five years. And what happens is because you have phones that have battery memory, so it's like if you tell your phone to like charge it midway, mm -hmm. and, the, and then like next time you try, and then if you keep doing it repetitively, the phone's going to think that de its definition of fifty percent is zero percent. Yeah, it's it's always a good idea to to drain your your portable devices like all the way, maybe like once a month or so, just to yeah. remind them what the bottom looks like. I didn't even know that was a thing. Mm -hmm. and, and yeah, like like there were some. Uh, I don't know. If, I don't know if the other newer phones have. Uh, I wonder if they did away with battery memory to where it's RS really good battery memory. But another thing that, that it's a bad habit is uh, not charging it in the proper voltage because you can because if it's not in a proper volt volt charge, you can, that could damage your battery too. Yeah, but mm -hmm. I think the risk is is like more about giving it too high a voltage rather than too low because like honestly lo longer charges are are better for batteries oh yeah but like but you need to give it, i mean yeah higher voltage is, is worse but mm -hmm. but if you don't give it even the proper voltage that the, that your standard charger has it it can over time it can it can mess up your battery all right so we have a it, it we have a like, stylish uh, fight going on here it looks like Slooch is going to be battling uh, craziness with craziness here. <laughs> yep. Oh, 15 wins. That's the same uh, win streak Slooch had against me when he was in Cleveland a couple weeks ago. <laughs> but yeah, this is uh, this is Slooch cold, so. Let's mm -hmm. see what we're what we're dealing with here, and this is and you can see this is definitely Mr. J, like respecting but also knowing that this is this is the wall that he's climbing up against because he's got Kunimitsu out and he wants to see how good uh, Kunimitsu oh, does against. I think he might be able to end the round right here. Maybe. Oh man. So here's the thing though. Hey, Apocrypha Seven B's in the Twitch chat. What up, Apocrypha? Long time no see. This is Black versus White in the chat. <laughs> No pun intended. The black, oh, the, yeah, black versus well, black and white. It's just the color of the costumes. I know what he meant. <laughs> <laughs> it's like we're gonna get banned. <laughs> Mr. J oh, just no. continuously counter, uh, yeah, counter hitting Chloe on startup there. Mm -hmm. Oh. All you right. really gotta, you really gotta respect Chloe though, because she can, she, she's another one of those characters where, you know, her sample combo does 104 damage. It's like I don't even need to learn the real combo. <laughs> I'm gonna get home for 100 anyway. One, two. Uh oh. Now, Sluge is one of those people that if he, if he catches on your patterns, even right now in a situation, he can run it back, no problem. Yep. Oh, nice. Damn, Kunimitsu's no damage slash either. No, she's not. She doesn't have the best damage, but she actually has the mix-up potential. Right. Now, now well, that we first see? game's going to go to Mr. J. Yeah, what are we going to do here? What are we going to see Mike do here? You know, it would be nice if I could take everything that's on stream right up now and, like, really return it directly into, like, an MP file. Like... But like, it's not that very intuitive when it comes to that. What like, I wish I wish the PC was more. I mean, you could possibly do it on PC, but it's not as intuitive as that straightforward PlayStation Four. Like, you played your game, you hit share, hit and then hit square. You know, mm -hmm. you, you already saved a replay video. So just just like snap <laughs> of a finger. Oh, are like, you trying to are you like trying that. to grab clips? Is it snowing where you guys yeah. are? Right no, nope. mm -hmm. uh, I don't think so. Uh, we, 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 we're living in an age of global warming. I think, so. Well, I think it's a little warm outside at the moment for that, but oh, it's a little it, warm dude, outside. It's, it's gonna uh, be it's gonna be like fifty degrees tomorrow. So, dude, it's thirty up here in Cleveland. I think it's gonna be cold again tomorrow. Because remember, we got lake effect snow. I don't know. Yes, if it you do. You guys, <laughs> all day. You guys go ahead and keep enjoying that. Oh, I am. Dude. I'm going snowboarding tomorrow. Are you kidding me? I'm ready to chill.
bringing out Eddie. Oh yeah, oh dude, dude, Eddie man, he loves his Eddie. He, you, I mean, he can. He's got those zone out. He's got the good back dash. Mm-hmm. He's got some good keep out tools. You have to basically have him to come at you. Eddie does have all that, but you know what he doesn't have? He doesn't have a wall combo because he has all this crazy evasiveness. And he doesn't so, have now, freckles. He doesn't have what? Freckles. What? It's a That's Futurama a- ge- reference. Don't worry about it. Yeah, dude, he's, he's, there's a gap in the LJ42 gene you were talking about. Oh, okay. that fre- freckles are, jacket. yeah, the LJ42. Wow, we are, we are really... It's literally the, the, the de- yeah, and we're speaking of the definition of black versus white. Look at that right here. Just realized I haven't been running my my logo slideshow this entire time. Or rather, oh, it was on the wrong layer. Mask. Got a watermark or people will steal. Look at that. Keep out, poke. Wait for him to come at you. Mr. J is really doing a good job. Yeah, he is. He's on fire. <laughs> Uh, he's he's been in the mix the entire time, so he's nice and warm at this point. Oh, he even man. he even ducked the unbreakable grab. Mm. Look at well, because it's kind of like what you expect. Most people eat that. And what is it like unbreakable? Ooh. As far as oh, wow. he got the run, hit the wall with that. Fight. Plus that frames nice. and no distance between the bodies means free hit. Oh no! It wasn't even that. It was the pushback oh. from the rage art. Uh, the rage art hit the wall, which allowed him to get extra t- to confirm hits right after. Mm-hmm. Oh, and now Casual's just picking him apart. Mm-hmm. This is just one thing that Sloot just excels at. Like if he can get you caught in the loop and have him second guessing yourself, he's gonna drain that life bar real quick. Wow, that elbows hitbox was crazy. I just love how he went from one dancer to another, and I know how much you wish he had Christy right now instead of it. Oh yeah, she's pretty hot. I mean, she pretty. is a hot. Uh-oh. She's a hot hot. Wow, hot. perfect. Anime Run thought patrol. <laughs> you know that could be a, that'd be an interesting uh, gamer user tag, user handle name. <laughs> Dude, don't tempt me. Hot box of rocks. <laughs> What'd you say? Hot thought. Hot, hot box hot of rocks. Patrol? Anime thought patrol. Anime thought, or hentai thought patrol. That, that would be interesting. Do you get? Do you one guys know funny, Skeezy? One of the funniest anime t-shirts. Skeezy, I ever no. Saw. Yeah, Skeezy's in the chat. An, <laughs> one of the funniest t-shirts I ever saw said "Anime in the Streets, Hentai in the Sheets." Yep. <laughs> That's so funny. Oh yeah. Yeah, ka- Kawaii in the Streets. Uh... Ka- kawaii in the Streets, Senpai in the Sheets. That's the. That's the. Mm-hmm. Check that out, man. Oh. Oh, I thought he was going to have a nice little carry there. Dude, that dash punch is nuts. All right, Kunai has been thrown. Oh, is this going to carry? Oh, he, so I dropped dealing, it a little what bit. We're dealing with right oh, now. Oh, 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 got it. oh, 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 last my second. God, with one second left, that was coming in clutch from Mr. J. Oh, man. Talk about suspense fest. Oh, no, he ran right into that. Man, he dropped his combo. Mm-hmm. <laughs> now, the fact that Mr. J is able to get in on Sloot, like the Sloot's facing is unforgivable. He will have you whiffing everything. Yep. Oh, and Eddie's got some really subtle motions, too, that you've got to be oh, right it's, on. It's, 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 it's not even that he has super subtle motions. It's that Eddie is a true 50-50 character in the sense where, so here's the thing. It seems as though Mr. J knows how to shut down relaxed stance. Mm-hmm. So, you know, Sluice can't get the R&R while he's playing Tekken right now. He's got to go in for the high-risk, high-reward 50-50 situations, and Mr. J's just getting caught up in it, it looks like. Which, which he, I think, I think Eddie, I mean, you know what? He can, he can do, he can do pretty good with risk and reward because he's got that good backdash. So he's, he's really a, a pure, he's really purely designed to be a with punish style character. He is, yeah, for sure. If you wait long enough with Eddie, your your opponent's going to make a mistake. And and, and and the reason why that's so hard for Kunimitsu is because she excels at range one, one and a half. And she has that kunai to get in. And if she hits you, she hits you. But that can only be punished by 11 and 10 frame punishers. And most characters don't have an 11 frame punisher. You have your magic four, but that's for counter hit purposes only. So a lot of the time, you're just hitting, the, hitting them with an I-10, essentially. So... You know, Lay, Lay has a 10-frame Punisher, I believe. Lay? 
Yeah, he does. Yeah, yeah, Lay does have a 10 frame Punisher. Yeah. It's not much, it's not damage, it doesn't do much damage, but it does lead him into, it does put him in a snake transition, which does give him a, a, a strong 50-50 mix-up mm -hmm. with the snake. Get ready for the mm -hmm. next so he can How lead. long have you been playing uh, Lay for? Dude, man, I, okay, so, like, I play Tekken casually from between two, three tags. Apparently, my brother's never owned four. Mm -hmm. Th then, like, and then Tekken Tag, uh, and then, like, you know, Tekken 5 came out, and I played it, and I played someone in high school, and he was into it, and then, like, not only I got back into uh, getting into playing Tekken, but mm -hmm. I, but that was my first time I got into it really competitively, and I thought, you know, I'm a big Jackie Chan fan. It's like, I'm really going to give Leia a shot. And then, uh, Razor Rushdown has always been disgusting in this game. Yeah, so it's a good. It's it's. I mean, it's a decent approach tool, but you can get you can get bodied by whiff punishes. So it's kind of oh, like yeah, absolutely. If you know how to if you know how to use it right, it it, it does have its use. Mm. Mm -hmm. All right, so the uh, <laughs> the infinite stage oh. probably. Oh, there's hyper Jill going for the going for the carry. Yep, and we've we've definitely swapped back to Master Raven. Yeah, Mr. J does not want to deal with any nonsense. No. It seems like to me. Like, you know, I'm going to give you my best because, like, I oh, love... Oh, nice little parry. This is what I was talking about, man. Like, and, and the worst part is, like, even though Eddie only has a pixel of health, you're in a 50-50 vortex. So he could still lose the game right in. Yeah, I think, and as far as I know, he doesn't... Uh, Eddie, he's, like, one of those very few people that do not have a 15-frame Punisher, uh, launch Punisher. Well, he, he doesn't get them because, like, it's it's he's one of those characters like Bob, where it's like, if we give him this, it'll be he'll be too strong. And then they're just like, nobody's playing Bob. Give him, give him a 15 frame punch. <laughs> yeah. And you Which know what? I, I, I call that bland buffs, to be honest with you. Okay. I mean, if you so, were to give him that, like, I, I don't mind it, but it, they should have made it under condition where it could have been launch punch, but like a 50 frame launcher. Uh, what is it like a hot? His hot. They give him a hop kick, right? So they because it's high, it's Ooh. minus. It's minus nine, and it's a high. So most hop oh. kicks, like most pop kicks, can be punished by, I, I believe, a 13 frame uh, a move. So uh, you know what I mean. So like, if I'm playing against Shaheen or Quality on the hop kick, oh, I can just that's gonna be something. Ball. Yeah, like if they were to give him a hop kick, like even though he wasn't meant to have a hop hop kick Blue like stuff. that. Oh. They should have, even if it was like a hide, they should have oh, made it like. And Casual's oh, got a time oh, scum. Oh, 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 man, playing real solid. Holy shit. Mm -hmm. What they is the Namco and only giving you 60 seconds for the fight? Um, Because it, it, it allows for. Um, it's like playing chess, but we're, we're each getting our turn. There are certain characters that can steal their turns back. Um, Eddie is one of those characters because he's in relaxed stance and all that good stuff. And then Ray yeah, and like all he has to do is like land like a combo on him, and then from there he just plays keep out. He waits for them to come mm -hmm. at them. Mm -hmm. But in this case, you know he's oh, trying to got something going. Camera swapped. Now, now Eddie is forced to play offensively now because he got yeah, his health because, taken. Because um, Mr. J knows how to deal with. Um, oh Lashley. wow! Jeez! Um, oh, I don't know wow! That, that turned That's around crazy. so fast. That really combos. I did not know that. I would not say that Sloosh is being forced to do anything. <laughs> well, here's the thing. Like, I haven't seen one parry from Mr. J yet, and I, I thought I'd see at least one. Man, these guys have a really good idea what moves they're going to do. Oh, you oh, have to. Because, like, and yeah, Casual's not getting fooled by the warp at all. Oh, you know what? That off axis, he didn't get the full damage out of it. I mean, dude, we're dealing with somebody that has like 15 years of Tekken experience. Like, yeah. even even the characters that people are like, I don't know how to play against that character. He's like, oh yes, this character. I mean, you should see Slooch and like the uh, the Cleveland Facebook chat. Like, if you ask him a question, the paragraph incoming. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, if there's a Jeopardy oh. like, if there's a Jeopardy Tekken edition, he'll probably get every damn answer right. Mm -hmm. Yeah, probably. probably. But Casual does take the lead here, two to one over Mr. J. Yeah, I'm telling you, man, uh, the, you know, if any player is the definition of Nintendo boss battles on acid, <laughs> that'd be huge. Oh, dude, a night nightmare. Eddie is an absolute nightmare to deal with, because even when you're at the highest level of play, it's still like, shit, I have to deal with Eddie. Oh, uh, let me get in there shit. with my Julia. I'll show him what's for. <laughs> dude, Julia is messed up. <laughs> she is so good. 
<laughs> her elbow. Okay, so she has this elbow. It's forward, forward one. Okay. Oh yeah, the party this started. Is why, this is why the elbow is so fucked up. Elbows cannot be parried. So oh, you can yeah. you can throw that against Asuka all day and <laughs> not worry about it. You can throw that against Leroy all day. You can't don't have to worry about it. That's how it's so it's messed up. So I just like using it as a as a carry mechanic because you know you pop them up and then you do like a whole bunch of you know forward forward squares and get them across the get them across the thing and then it, what what is it, a triangle it is hands down the best approach tool in the game square triangle and it's plus like on block so here's the thing you can sidestep it but oh the apparently is geese so small. apparently geese beats the elbow that's good well he can parry anything. Oh, uh, of course. Guest character mechanics. Dude, Leroy can uh, parry anything, too. Leroy. Like I said, man, I'm super stoked right now because Cleveland's got Go Puff now. You know what I'm talking about? I'm, I'm just snacking on some Ritos right now. Real happy about that. Like real Ritos or 3D Ritos? Doritos. Fight. 3D printed. What, what's the whole What's the whole thing on the ad? Like once in the Grand Blue Moon, they always has like it's like you know the brand. It's like they always got those red and blue bags, but they don't show the label. Because <laughs> if, if they're not getting else? paid, they're not going to advertise. Oh yeah. They do the same thing on like the Great British Bake Off, where they use a particular like brand of soy sauce or whatever else. And if they're <laughs> no not getting if they're not getting here, sponsor man. money, they cover up the label, so you like you know, so you're not supposed to know. But if you use it, then you know. And then it's you think, man, kinda... I really need some more La Choya. <laughs> it's just so kind of it's just so kind of silly though. <laughs> but yeah, I actually bought a bag of 3D Doritos today. Spicy Cool Ranch, and they are. Dude, you know what Cool Ranch? You know what Cool Ranch is called in the UK? It's called American. It's called like American. Oh, American style. Something. Yeah. 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 Because we're cool and we all have ranches. Man, oh, thirty head of cattle like each. Weird, it's like those weird bubbly looking shaped Doritos or something. Yeah, that's them. I just. I just oh, oh, like, casuals on tournament point. Oh, she's going to have to do so like much work. I Doritos Locos Taco because it roughly translates into the crazy Dorito Taco. <laughs> cool Ranch was you the best I flavor and they killed I it. I love the I love the Locos Tacos, honestly. So they're so good. Mm -hmm. that, that's how I know uh, the CEO of that place is, is, is a stoner, bro. It's like, dude, we're putting shit in Doritos. It should have been a thing that they started doing decades ago. Well, dude, the walking taco has been a thing since the 80s, yeah. you know? Hi, Omega. Yes, we know Taco Bell's not real tacos. <laughs> no, it ain't. But it's damn good. It is. But they are, good. Yeah, but they are cheap and readily available at 2 in the morning. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh both have their red morning. dress on. Oh, no. Oh, oh my, my God. God. Casual the stuck that in. The devastation is real. It's like half of our commentating Ooh. conversations is like nothing involved. Half of it's like most of it's like nothing involved with the match. <laughs> And that is going to do it. Holy crap. Lucia Libre swinging for the fences. Takes that uh, takes that final game. Three to one. Grand finals. And the prize pool is bragging rights. Pretty much. At least until we get Macharino approved. Is that really, is that really prize pool? Uh, I mean, there's typically not. But if we do get Macharino, we can make a prize pool. That'd be sick. I'd, I'd put money into that every week. Are you yeah. kidding me? That'd be awesome. But, uh, yeah, we're still waiting for approval on that. I suspect we probably won't hear anything until, like, the start of the new year. But, um, which, of course, you know, I just had to pick the, the weeks where I couldn't do my entire stream schedule due to the holidays. Oh, all you would have to do for that as soon as it gets approved, just um, just get, like, a, um, a PayPal and then just have everybody just pay five bucks into, like, a PayPal thing. Oh, I mean, I already have that. I've got a pay. I've got a PayPal link at the uh, on my Twitch page. But um, uh, yeah, I, for Street Fighter, we actually had a donor who was doing fifty bucks a month, um, or sorry, fifty bucks a week uh, into the prize pool, and he would pass that to me, and then I would distribute in his name. But um, he's discontinuing really nice, that man. practice to make a larger prize pool 
for uh, like Ohio only monthlies for the game. Yeah, man, I'm actually in Columbus a lot because my uh, my aunt lives in Powell. Oh, okay. Um, I used to work so, at the Aldi up there. Dude, there's this really good like spot in Powell. They have like a a peanut butter jelly burger. Oh, that's uh probably east of Chicago pizza then. No, no, it's like a it's like a it's like a high uppity like diner in Powell. Like no, like a really nice spot in Powell. Oh. I just forgot what I call. Okay. So good though. All right. Well, real quick, uh, Sloosh is, is getting his goodbyes in because it sounds like um, it sounds like he's got to hit the sack. <laughs> oh, it's bedtime for Sloosh, man. Yeah, a little bit. He's got to wake up with the with the children and the sun. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but uh, yeah, Sloosh, good stuff tonight, buddy. Always good seeing you. Uh, real quick, let's go to the bracket and see how we ended up tonight. So uh, first Pretty place, good. yeah, competitive casual, not dropping a set, gets that 4-0. Uh, Mr. J coming through with a four and two for second. Britty Spears three and two for third. And then on down the line, Artsy Nate fourth. Tw uh, Two-way tie for fifth between Fire Kung Fu Hero and Ola. Uh, Two-way tie for seventh between Donnie and Subway Wang. And We're then up. bring up the rear. <laughs> it's magic time in A Chef. Um, but yeah, good stuff from those guys. And uh, yeah, before we go, we just want to run through some some stuff. Uh, not even really point in advertising it this week, but hey, just every Thursday, just not this one. Uh, Grand Blue Fantasy Versus on PC uh, Thursday nights, 9 p.m. Come on by, play some good old stuff. It actually plays like Tatsunoko versus Capcom, so Mega Zero has no excuse to not come play it. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, also, Ohio only tournaments, Dragon Punch Online, Street Fighter V, Power Rangers Battle for the Grid, uh, <laughs> Killer Instinct, Tekken 7, Melty Blood, Dragon Ball Fighters, and King of Fighters, uh, year variable. Uh, all available to play every Saturday night on our good friend Shaolin Pretzels stream. Starts at 7 p.m. Swing by for Shaolin news. Pretzels, say what? Shaolin Pretzels. Like the monks, but with German baked goods. Uh, but yeah, that's Dragon Punch. And then, of course, don't forget about Versus Corona. That's our Tatsunoko versus Capcom series that we uh, stream here on this channel. Usually the last Sunday of every month, hosted by Dr. Science and J.M. Crofts. Uh, it's just a good afternoon, usually starting around 2 p.m. of us, like, vegging out and watching some high-def, uh, high-res Tatsunoko versus Capcom being played on Dolphin across the grand old continent of North America. That game was so much fun. <laughs> still is. Still is. Now, um, I didn't know it still had a scene. Yep. Uh, we've been doing... Well, yeah, I got involved with the scene at Frosty Faustings, and then uh, we've been doing offline... Started by weeklies, then went to monthlies since March. So... Dude, uh, Alex Ryu was my team. Oh, it's and still it's still a team. Although I think uh, we got somebody out there who likes playing like Alex Roll. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, Roll's a fun one too. But definitely swing by for that. We don't have a date on that for January yet, but I'm sure we will come up with it and then we'll just advertise the crap out of it. There's Magno just Man plays Alex about, Roll, that's right. <laughs> there's just something fantastic about playing an actual fighting game on a GameCube controller. <laughs> yeah, well, and then um, Omega Zero here in the, in the Twitch chat is our, uh, I think our two-time champion uh, and our uh, resident giant character expert three times three times oh there is a date okay i don't keep up with my discords as, as well as i should but anywho. you know the best the best part about that game was online dude mm. the wii actually didn't even have bad net code for it like i had so much fun playing well, that game. now we're now we're using dolphin net code it's actually Thank good you. enough that you can ah. do cross country what yeah um in fact uh there's i think uh dr science also has a texas based uh aws server for it so we can even do it on parsec if we if we get the you know the groundswell for it i finally have a reason to download dolphin i'm going to play a game for my child oh yeah well just so you know to to do tvc you have to download a very specific version of dolphin mm -hmm. uh if you get into the discord uh yeah all, all that stuff's there anywho um but yeah tvc super fun 
Back to this stuff. I uh, just want to thank everybody who came by tonight. Uh, yeah, just suddenly blew up into an 11 person bracket, 10 player bracket, uh, which was unexpected, especially between the holidays. Um, but uh, I think we had a, a lot of good fun tonight. Uh, thank you to uh, Mr. J for getting on commentary with me, along with uh, Fire Kung Fu Hero and uh, Donnie over here. I've tried I my best. Longest, I think this is like the longest commentary I've been on so far. Possibly. We are pushing uh, three and a half hours at this point. <laughs> but most of that oh, is dude. just menus. Um, so. But uh, I'm, yeah, if you if guys I, are... Play, if I was still in the tournament, I wouldn't even be talking that much. Yeah, if you guys are out there and you're interested in playing uh, Tekken with us, uh, we run it every other week uh, here on Tuesdays at 9 p.m. Swapping platforms each time we do. So, of course, this week was PlayStation. Uh, in two weeks, it'll be back on PC. The in-between weeks are devoted to Soul Calibur. So if you're also a fan of that, uh, I believe next week will be PC Soul Calibur. So PC Tekken will follow that. And then, you know, back to PSN. Um, uh, but uh, definitely swing by if you can. And if not, well, always welcome cheerful and lively Twitch chat conversation. Um, but that's going to do it for me tonight. Uh, remember everybody, we're still in the midst of this whole thing, so please be smart, wear your mask, wash your hands, uh, observe that good social distancing. Remember, it's, it's not, it's not social distancing, it's melee range. And if everyone's outside of it, you're doing good. Yeah, but you just got, and, and, and anyone gets near you, you just got a whiff punish on Exactly, just whiff punish. You don't like, want oh, a whiff oh, 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 you, get, you can't get your, a whiff of a Smash player. Man. Yeah, get, get getting your breath on me? Uh-uh. <laughs> See? You know, too not close. to get into not to get into politics too much, but just to be cut it short. I heard that the Senate has paid doctors. Let's take over the rate of great assault. I heard the Senate has uh paid the doctors to basically any anyone that has died from any other reason, they write them off as COVID victims. Mm -hmm. So there are people, even though there are people that died from COVID. But they, but they, the numbers could be exaggerated. So, uh, I mean, yeah, but there's also a million people that could have died from it that we don't know about. Yeah, but they, but they could be like some of those millions. They could be, they could be right off as like they could have been like died from other reasons that brought them as COVID victims. I don't know what the, uh, I, I, that's taking I, the brain I, of I think, thought, the, I, I think that's okay. actually kind of unfounded. But I, I mean, it's just it, it. it there are enough people dying from it that they wouldn't need to inflate the numbers to make any kind of sense out of it. To, to make what any I kind heard, of extra thing. What out. I heard on the news is that COVID deaths and complications of COVID deaths are being uh, placed in the same bracket. That's what I've heard. So if they are inflated, you know, here's the thing though. If people say like, oh, it killed 1% of the American population, right? People are like, okay, who cares? That's 1%. Well, that's 3 million people. You know what I mean? So. Yeah. So, but it's still, it's still, I mean, that. yeah, the, the complications that arise from having a disease are, I mean, it's, it's still stuff that you don't want to be caught living with after the fact. So it's still just a really great idea to, to just chill. Please wear your mask. Please social distance. Please make smart choices out in the world. And uh, if if and when the vaccine becomes available, please get it. Because the, the, the faster we all approach herd immunity, the, uh, the better we're going to be. We're back, mm -hmm. back to normal. IRL tournaments. No more temperature checks. No more, uh, like, I mean, don't you want to just, like, don't you want to shake the hand or pump the fist uh, of, like, the person right next to you when you when you finally get around to taking them in a, in a best of five, like, you know, back in an IRL tournament situation? So with that as the goal, everyone, please continue to keep yourself safe. And uh, we will catch you back here next time. Peace out, Girl Scouts. <laughs> yep. All right. Bye, y'all. Thanks for having me. Mm -hmm.